Fill her up. You're listening to the Gas Digital Network. Is that? We're starting. No, 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 Fucking gay. I know they are gay. Well, that's why we're wearing the same color sweatshirt because we fucked it and then we wore the same. Wow, that was good. This does not have one Thanks. pump of sugar free vanilla. <laughs> <laughs> I said you. And then we. It's gonna put it out there. It doesn't have what? It does not have one, one pump, pump of, of sugar free vanilla. I'll give you Danny, okay. my beverage is perfect. Danny, this is why I BYOB. <laughs> Mine's perfect too. Yeah, hmm. perfect beverage. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, Danny. Also, Thank you, Spider. You guys are fucked when he decides to poison everybody. One P S F V. Yeah, one pump. The pump don't now. work because the vandals took the handles. You know what I mean, boys? All right, boys. We're What's here. up? It's great to see you. Well, this this podcast is kind of blowing up. Huge. It's huge. huge. It's huge. 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 We, we, should, ever. we, we should definitely should have did this do. ten years ago. <laughs> we did. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we, we did. did. We did it consistently ten years I ago. I wish you guys never left. We didn't leave. You started doing it at night. That's yeah. the you started fundamental. That, that, is, that is the truth. You moved it and, to Monday night. And then you started. I did. You invited Nobody like left. Mike Cannon. You invited other fucking, people that we weren't some fat comfortable with. Wait a minute. Bitch. Let me ask at you a question. At one point, we yeah, tried to book that? it. I don't know. Remember, there was a fat blonde bitch on the show for a while. He would just Kelly? show up and he'd be like, <laughs> "Yeah, dude, this is Chris. He makes stuff." Yeah, and like, then you just have to sit next to him and be like, "Hi, Chris." At one point, I looked in. I looked out at the table and I was like, "Am I Mike Cannon? Is that where I'm at in my life?" And I had to move on. You fucked up. We all. I love doing the show. I yeah. love coming here. Walking up these stairs, sure. I get hit with the memory of like joy. This yeah. is a joyful place to be. Yeah. Great time. The the issue was the podcast moved to Monday nights. And I actually think you wanted to spread it around a little. Spread yeah. what around? You the love, you started, the guests. You started thinking I did that not, we were I, getting no, a No, little... no, no, no. There's two sides to every story, you fucking assholes. I said you, I think. Stop. Don't come hot. You, Don't come hot. I said right. I think. I'm coming hot a little. I You're right. I'll bring it down. But I'll the night thing is unnegotiable. I've the night I've time. matured. Here's the thing, sure. though. Can I say something? I had a kid. Yes. Okay. And I moved. And I moved it tonight because it was easier for me. But Understandable. hang on. Hang on. Um, you guys, like all three of you guys had nothing. And then all of a sudden you had a show. Then you started doing stuff. Then you started doing stuff. What are you talking about? Uh, you guys had other things you started uh, doing, uh, and you nothing? couldn't. Hang on, you was, couldn't. Uh, you couldn't. Well, uh, top one hundred on last comic standing, my friend. I was top ten. Top one hundred on the. Well, you know, there's a th- like ten. You guys Hello. had thousands of comedians at out there. the at the beginning of it. You get away from me. <laughs> <laughs> at the beginning of it, it, you guys started getting stuff. And you start. I can't make it. You couldn't make it. He couldn't make it. Then baby, it baby, you. baby. Guy code was in full production. Exactly. Breaking guy code. Exactly. And just so you know, wasn't I, just I, was on, I was on season one, episode two of Guy Code. I want to put that out there. You were. I didn't even show up until season and three. And also, I want to also add. What's Guy Code? It was an MTV2 show. It was huge. Was, it's a car insurance company. Schultz blew up. Uh, Chris everybody D blew up. Everybody but Dan me. was there. I was there. <laughs> Pete Davidson, a little Chris Duvall. D has blown up three times in his career and then like yeah. simmered down. It's happened so many times. But I also want to. I also want to say back to the. Zap. He's there. He really is like a, a pot of soup. <laughs> Back to the discussion, not argument, discussion. Yeah. When are you there also your... wasn't a moment. What is it? When are you growing your beard back? Because it's disturbing. As soon as I can. It was for a film role. I know. I'm sorry. Oh, what's really bad? Role? Isabel Hagen's is film. It, Ever hear it, of it? Is it a documentary on Don Knotts? <laughs> Come on. That was good. The reference was, pretty, was a little old. Uh, but... Don Knotts is not old for you. We got a little thing here called a podcast. There you go. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> I don't know what that is. That's Don Knotts. But. Also, let's be, uh, let's call a, let's a jizz a Jew or whatever you say, whatever say, the thing is. I'll say Jew now. I know. I love him. <laughs> Anyways. Are you on Israel's side? Yes. <laughs> you are. Of course we are. Are we? Well, yes, we are. <laughs> They're all dirty m- 
because in my uh, mind, I don't give a shit if they're from Israel or from the fucking uh, love, Hamas. What's wrong with you? I love, Fuck I love a Lewis. Fuck the USA. Fuck Jesus, Christ. USA. I mean, he's got Jesus Christ. USA. Jesus Christ. USA. Jesus Christ. Fuck off. But Everyone you did else. not present it then as, hey, <laughs> why don't you all come in every week and, and that'll be the show. Yeah. If, if you would have said, Bob, this is true, this is on you. Bob, hold on, let me but say it's this. true. If we you would have said, your show. if you would have said to us ten years ago, let's just make this the show. Yeah. We'll be equal partners in it. Listen, this was on you. Yeah, listen. We would have all listen, said yes. I'm gonna say something right. right now. We had nothing going on, and at that time, we would have all loved it. But you were a greedy, fuck greedy. Jew. I, I. Oh, That's why you're on their side. That was a good Jewbox. You had you. Yeah, you finally got it. Your anti-Semitism <laughs> took you to Jewbox. <laughs> Happy Hanukkah. <laughs> That's pretty good. But anyways, we're all here now. Here now. Now is which, the only time which, that matters. Which Five years too late. I think is better. Too late. I think it's better now. We're hitting. I think it's better now. We're huge. Oh, by the way, I think I got money coming for you guys. I would like that Ooh. very much. I mean, wait, where, where is the money Sorry. back? Stop it. What do you mean? I pay from your kratom. Why do you say think? <laughs> wait, we're supposed to get money from mint. We're supposed to get money from sheath oh, underwear. Oh, yeah. Well, when does the mint money come What's up with money? mint? The mint money is the one that I'm talking about. The sheath underwear. The, the spot. Do you guys not... So, for, do you guys do uh, podcasts, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah, you guys do podcasts, right? You just fell down, yeah. down the hill. Why do you got to touch me? Touch oh, Dan. Don't, don't touch me. <laughs> you guys do podcasts. You know that podcast advertising money doesn't come in for at least two It's a good months. point because Bob right. is still waiting on his from yeah. 2009. <laughs> <laughs> I never had ads. Yeah. We never had yes, ads. You did. Wait, yes, ads. you did. My ads. You had ads. What ads? Name one. Um, None. I could tell. I could. Uh, no, 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 we can remember them. Bop, bop, bop. Mm-hmm. There absolutely was ads. Had no ads. Yes, no, there was 100%. No ads. Was, we did ad reads no on ads. the show. Yes, we did um, ads. I, I remember them. What? Name one. We Sherry's were doing berries. the middle of the- Name. Sherry's Berries. I never had a Sherry. What is you a Sherry's Berries? Sherry's fucking what is berries. That? I, what is that? Oh, you fucking shit. Sh- Sherry's Dude, there was a Sherry's Berries. I'm trying they to think up of what clip? exactly what you, you... You definitely made us do reads. You didn't do a read. Yeah, 100% you made us do reads. All right, well, I didn't get money for it. It was all it was all. So you did free up. reads? Yeah, free reads. You did the worst... Can we talk about... I never had in, reads. Yeah, Sherry's Berries. Can we talk about Joe being a father instead of yeah. just reiterating the fact that Luke, we should have done this podcast? I am your father. His name is Luke? Did you, cut, right. did you cut the umbilical cord? No, they didn't give me an umbilical cord option. They just snipped it right in front. But it was did, quite a scene. Did you have a? Uh, did it come out of the vagina or out of the stomach? Out of the stomach, and I looked into the hole. No! Oh, whoa! You, oh, so she man. got a C-section. Yes, and she, I looked right in. There. She couldn't handle fucking. Did you put a note in there that she can find in a couple? Years? Do you feel no, le- do you do love it. her less because she didn't deliver your baby naturally? No, we tried that. It was taking a long time. Our doctor's shift was ending, so they just went in there and. <laughs> I'm not even lazy joking. doctor. Did you? He goes. You know what? I got an eight o'clock dinner res. I got a tea time tomorrow. How about early? we just? Uh, how about we pop got a reservation my... for the Capitol Grill? How about so... we pop the kid out the sunroof? <laughs> I'm a Del Frisco's guy. <laughs> yeah. Did you? We should all go to Del Frisco's. I, I love Capitol Grill's way better than Del Frisco's. Mm-hmm. You're out of your Both fucking are delicious. mind. I gotta say something out I, of your mind. I think he's right. Yeah. Del Frisco's is dropped. Del Frisco's is like if it's dropped. I'm unaware. Like. Chris, that's yeah, some trashy dude, shit. Dude, they got new oh. management. New you're like, if you're a black suck. woman on her 40th birthday, you go to Del Frisco. Well, no, I we're going to Red say, Lobster, baby. I like a, I like Eddie V's. Eddie V's. Eddie, is the Eddie Vedder, baby. Eddie Austin. Austin. In Austin, Texas? No, they have them here. The chain. They're everywhere. Oh, so good. Can we wait? Eddie V's is Eddie Vedder's? No. Yes. Let's don't no, listen. No, God, no, no. What? Yeah, Bobby, we could have had a whole thing. It's been fun. I we know. Had, uh, Dude, yeah, Chris uh, Cornell's. I would have walked in. Jeremy <laughs> spoke. Here. Come on. <laughs> Can I get the Vitology? <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say, real quick, if like, Del just cover myself is, in cherry pie and every fucking. If it has new ownership, if it's dropped, yeah. I'm unaware of it. Yeah. But five, six years ago, Del Frisco's oh, way better than Capital. I've been twice. They got new management. They took oh, all the cool shit off the radio. menu. Oh, they it, did? It's bad. They used to have a lot of cool, fun it's, and they And when you order something, it never comes out. Like, if you order medium, you got to send it back. It's raw. Call it's the way they cook it. It's I right. want to hear. We can't ask them because they're what? Know, retards. <laughs> they don't know. They can't go to steakhouses, these folks. <laughs> is it, well, let me ask you a question. Is Capital Grill... Trash or is it nice? It's, it's nice. trash. No, it's trash. It's not. Del Frisco's is good. Del Frisco's <laughs> is here. Capital Grill is under here. No, but now that Del Frisco's Capital died, Grill. Ah, Capital Grill. First switched. of all, it's a fucking expensive meal every time. I went last night. There's never a time where I go and it's not a wild amount of money. Is it any cheaper than a fucking? Because it's a chain. But is it? Hold on, I'm getting to something. Have you been to Del Frisco's? I've never been to Del Frisco's. What? <laughs> wow. Just You've go. You've never been? It fucking never is been. killing it. It's been. unbelievable. It's I've been to Ruth Chris. I've been to uh, no, Ruth Chris. Del Frisco's is Ruth way Chris. better than Ruth Chris. Ruth, Ruth Chris, Chris is, is in every town. Del Frisco's is I'll in like what, Philly, though, New York. I'll tell you what, though. Best Boston. dessert in any restaurant, the butter cake at Del Frisco's. 
it fucking rocks. Bobby, yes. Bobby that was just a, that was just a tray of butter. Yeah. He goes, sir, you're yeah. not. He goes, sir, you're not supposed to. You know what? Let him eat it. Bobby had a candle in it for his birthday. <laughs> the other waiter's going to stop him. No, 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 no. I've, I've waited on it before. Guys, him, guys the butter at Del Frisco's. Yeah. Yeah. It's it it like whipped butter. The like, butter tastes like cake. He comes back. He goes, what is this? And the lady goes. Cake? <laughs> Happy birthday? Is, <laughs> Happy this birthday. This is unbelievable, dude. This is so good. Dude, it's She's so like, smooth. It melts in your mouth. Uh, I want to see <laughs> who has better reviews, Capital Grill or Del Frisco's, because I think you guys are way off. Uh, I'm telling you, Del Frisco's uh, fell off. I've never been to Del Frisco's. We no. go, the comedy cellar, Noam takes us all out to the dinner like every six months. We to. always do Del Frisco's. For 15 years we've done, we changed it. Uh, we stopped going. He mm. he. We went to uh, what's that? No uh, Nobu last time because Del Frisco. Oh, Nobu. Yeah, it's off. No but the, the the lemon cake. <laughs> I, you know, I did all yes, of these sir. fucking. Yes, sir. Beer. Look at that. A thousand one stars. Oof, that's not good. From who? Which which restaurant was a that? A thousand one stars yeah. for Del Frisco. Yeah. How many five stars? How many how many one stars? Not a thousand. I, know, I just said it, but I know it was going to go back. <laughs> Looks like it's doing all right. Yeah, look at all those five stars. Yeah, I'm telling you, it stinks. Go to the one star. Read it. Ambiance, stunning nah, service, it's exceptional it's food, S- delicioso. Service is not. Someone the find ambiance of a fucking chain restaurant. Someone find Tom E and rip his cock off, please. Did he book the strip. Read a one star. What does it say? Hilarious. Too touristy. Lots of young we had touristy is ridiculous. We had a 9 p.m. reservation for my husband's birthday tonight. Upon walking in, the two hostesses were unwelcoming. You keep changing Why the side. Why are you it? doing this? Who, who, who is that? I'm Max. trying to read who Mona, is that? Mona T. Max. What is Guys, it? Stop yelling. Mo, go to Mona T's thing. I was in the middle of reading Mona T's. Beat him up. You can beat him up. Dude, he's stupid. He's go dumb. down. What a dumbass. Go down. I, On me. Mona T. Leave it there. There you go. We asked to sit upstairs. Stop touching it. Since it was noticeably quieter and more private for a birthday dinner. They said upstairs is closed and offered a booth downstairs, which sounds reasonable. <laughs> that was literally centered around everyone in the restaurant. So pause it right now. As of it right now, so this person's a cunt. Yeah, just an idiot. They wanted to go to a closed section of the restaurant where there yeah. was nobody working, and they said, well, no, it's not, it's not open. They claimed upstairs was closed, but there was plenty of people merrily sitting up there. They're merrily up there. Merrily? And they were taking reservations till Yeah, this is an asshole. So right, weird. Scroll yeah, down. Scroll down. Scroll down. Sucks. Scroll down. And the other one called it touristy, which is just absurd. Oh, I want to wake up from this nightmare and to be told this was all just a bad <laughs> What? Dream. I didn't go to a restaurant. The chef I... raped me on my <laughs> table. I better say Jeez. that. I, it was an enemy from my childhood that had taken over the restaurant and turned it into the a rust. I didn't real really I didn't really go to a restaurant based on a 4.5 Google review and had one of the absolute worst dining experiences of my life. I don't know how the this people sleep at night knowing the food that they're serving for those prices. Lamb chops were $80. Were the, the lamb chops for $80 were the most disgusting pieces of meat that I've had in my life. Food was terrible. Disgusting. Psycho. The server, bartender, was bossy, impatient, and rude. Yeah, you were eating at the bar. Well, impatient is not the word. It's impatient, not an impatient. Impatient. Is that what she oh, wrote? Yeah. She, she wrote, wrote impatient. <laughs> she also wrote the Rost dinner. Over 31 years. Did I really spent two hundred dollars on the Ross dinner. I seriously feel rubbed. <laughs> yeah, dude. I can't really. I can't, I can't really. This is a joke, right? Yeah, that's got to be a joke. I, it's Joe List. That's the way I write. I understood everything she said. <laughs> yeah, jo- we should have had Bobby translate. I've, re- I've 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 read Ross. I've written Ross. Let's go down to Nicholas B and As- Asbury Park. I actually think a three star review. You'll probably get a more realistically bad review. There you go. Right so, here. So so sad to see such a classy establishment let people walk in without proper attire. Uh, I'm gonna push back on that. I wore a hoodie to the one in Philadelphia, and they were like, "You can't wear a hoodie in here." Ooh. It was kind of a nice. Ooh, I'll tell you right now, hoodie, and they were like, "You can't do that." Capital Grill, they say nothing. I walk in, I'll walk in with a pair of fucking basketball I've shorts. Won, right, they clearly won the argument. <laughs> yeah, I'm starting to think maybe they wouldn't uh, let me wear Capitol a hoodie. They, they let That's Lewis crazy, in. Dude. They let me in just in general. I like Capital Grill better, and Capital Grill has seafood too. Really good. Del Frisco's has seafood. Yeah, but it's fucking gaba. It's like one piece of fish in Stop one it. way. You, you know, want to be a real piece of trash? So I try to, I try to trick James because James, his favorite restaurant, Capital Grill. Ask him, be like, hey, what do you, what do you love? He's like, Capital Grill, Dad. Let's go. What does he love at Capital Grill? We usually, usually we get like four or five appetizers and then we split a steak. That's fun as hell, right? So we'll get like what we, what we have last night. Apps with one apps main. All Lewis knows day. how to order. By the way, Lewis. Lewis knows how. To, I he, Lewis. he took uh, apps with a steak. He took he took James out for the birthday and me and Max went. Oh, it's Grill, yeah. And I, I'm very particular when I go to a fancy restaurant, and I was like, "Ah, oh, fuck! I, I hope this doesn't suck." And I think I was fat at the time too. Yeah. And I wanted food, and Louis, Louis 
gets everything. I say, guys, just chill. Sit yeah, back. Yeah. I yeah. fucking got you. Pick, you pick your main course, and I got it. So last night we had um, oysters. Great. To nice. start, love me some oysters. Aphrodisiac for oh, the lady. Yeah. yeah. Get James all horned up. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, you, you James, the lady. Not James, <laughs> stop wiggling in your seat. You've had too many oysters. <laughs> <laughs> James, you're glowing. <laughs> James is shirtless. <laughs> <laughs> James, you're getting super into the music that's playing. He's <laughs> fried calamar. Calamari. I love fried, fried calamar. calamar. Oh, that yeah. Oh, fried uh, the uh, the the uh, the, no, the the you know the the cheese the mozzarella with the with the like uh, almost regatta and mozzarella mix. With Let him burrata. Let him burrata. Burrata. Love a burrata. Burrata. Love a burrata. Extra bread. But with tomatoes or uh, no, roasted peppers. Tomatoes and roasted peppers. Ooh, they and have both. They have both. Nice. I like both. I right? like both. Uh, what was the other appetizers? Sounds like Jim Gaffigan's set list. Hello, folks. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let food. him catch you saying that. He's oh, we got the bacon. Oh, fuck your shit. Uh, he'll he'll Wait, fucking, really? He'll grab you by the Jim Gaffigan. not the neck, but the shoulders. everyone knows he's the abominable snowman. Oh, he'll fuck your shit up, dude. Yeah. Oh, I'm only kidding. He's my favorite. He'll, <laughs> he'll punch you right in your n- not chin. <laughs> he's gonna talk in that other voice, and that's how you know he's about to get violent. He goes. You know, I don't really like when you talk like that. <laughs> you know, you make me real mad. Yeah. I told you one of my... This uh, guy wants to fight you. Oh, <laughs> it looks like... That's gonna, his alter. He goes, oh, this guy's... You're going to have to shove your foot up his ass, Jim. This guy wants to take your children goes, from uh, you. No, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I love Joe. He goes, it's you're going to let him... Person. You're going to let him walk all over you? <laughs> he goes, I don't think ah, I'm Jay's a good guy. He's just another he's comedian. He's a funny comic. He goes, <laughs> you're, you're letting him show your weakness. You better stomp his ass out. <laughs> I don't know about you that. You better cook yeah. him like a hot pocket, Jim. <laughs> Do it now. You, you better box this motherfucker up, Jim. <laughs> you better put him in a to-go container. <laughs> it's always food analogy. <laughs> yeah. you, better, you better reheat these beef, this beef, Jim. Ooh. Well, I don't know. He came in a little undercooked, Jim. <laughs> oh, time to put him on the stove. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, nice. I was sitting next to Gaffney one time at the stand years ago, the old stand, and there was a comic on stage. Exactly. I don't even remember who, Yeah. so don't even ask. But he went. <laughs> Joe remembers. We're, sit, the way. we're sitting next to each other. <laughs> he remembers. Yeah, he one hundred yeah, percent remembers. I, I honestly, and it's, and it's I honestly know. And someone we all know. Uh, someone we all know. He immediately. I promise. Swear to God, I don't. And after the show, you're going to say who was it? it was I'm going to say I legitimately don't know. But he was sitting like this, and I'm next to him. And he's doing like the comics over here, and then he looks at me, and looks back at him, and then looks at me, and he goes, "I'm sorry. I know we don't. We're not that close, but." Don't you think being mildly amusing should be a prerequisite to be a fucking comedian? <laughs> I was yeah. like, I fucking die. Like, I know, I know. And you know who it is. I, I swear Joe, to God, you I don't know who it was. Joe, yeah. It was like it was it was somebody that's not around anymore. Yeah, like a so you do know who it is. No, no, it was like one of those people that's around and then they're not. And oh, I yeah, can't remember that. But it was awesome. Chris Scopo, Fringe, might have been Scopo. <laughs> it was probably no, Scopo. it wasn't a. It wasn't one of us. If you know I, what I, I mean. I'm sorry, we went off on a Gaffigan rant. Get back to. My other apps? Yeah. I don't know what the other app I God we, damn we, right, we ordered dude. five. Maybe it was only four apps last night. Cheers. Usually you order like five or six. Yeah, you, I mean, I like, I like really... Salads. A, a tuna tartare. Yeah, obviously get a you salad. You are a tartare. Then we go... <laughs> <laughs> what a great name if instead of retard, start calling people tartars. Oh. <laughs> a steak tartare. We <laughs> <laughs> got a real tuna tartare over here. <laughs> <laughs> this guy probably can't live on his own. I remember Halloween a few years ago. Um, this is when me and Kim were together. We went to James. James's school had like a like a Halloween party. Argued out Halloween. front for thirty minutes. <laughs> no, I but I brought out. Like I was choked drinking, her out. She threw lawn. something. Lewis duck and rolled. I uh, I was drinking a latte, and James was being a pirate this year, and I was being a, I was his parrot. I had a giant parrot. Costume. That's sick. So it was like That's you know great. it was awesome. So I was like his you know big parrot. Yeah, and I played a prank on him too. I was like, I was James. I'm also going to be a pirate. Right, and he's like, "Oh, that's cool. We'll both be pirates." And then I went in the bathroom and I came out as a parrot. I was like, "Oh, you misunderstood me. I meant parrot." I thought he was gonna thought it was the funniest thing in the world, and he was like, "Okay, that's weird." Because <laughs> he's smart. The, fir- the first year that he was like, the, yeah. like a "Dick," he sighed. Yeah. He was like, <sighs> Got it. Oh, good so one. So we went parrot, to pirate. we went to his um <laughs> we went to like it was a Halloween party in the auditorium. It was just crazy. Just kids running all over. Yeah. And I'm wearing this hot ass fucking. Uh, uh, parrot costume, and I'm holding a latte, dude. And you know me, I just, I, if I get worked up, whatever it is, is so I'll have an incident, dude. And I had an what? incident. I dropped the latte, and it spilled everywhere. Wait, do you start calling your spazzes incidents? Yeah, yeah. I was, I was. Someone's going to therapy. Four, four days without an incident. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> four days ago. Um. So then I dropped the latte. And I was like, oh, fuck, there's no paper towels. Yeah. And I'm like looking for paper towels. And I'm just huffing and puffing and grumping. And Kim like just slowly walked away from me to like That's be true. away. 
and there was other parents. She heard them talking shit, and they were just like all talking shit about me. And the one dad was like, "Yeah, check out Two Can Sam over here." <laughs> right. Right. And so I'm like, "Oh, it's walking in my." <laughs> <car."> <laughs> That's <laughs> the problem with Halloween parties is you forget. We talked about this years ago. We go out and you see couples fighting, and they're dressed as like you know Fred and Wilma. Oh yeah, Dude, the best. We, we saw there was two couples in uh, New Orleans. Uh, they were, I was dressed as a Ninja Turtle. Kim was dressed as a. Uh, Chiquita Banana, mm-hmm. um, and Holy. there was two Ninja Turtles. It was a boyfriend and girlfriend fighting, and I, I was Raphael. It was Michelangelo and Donatello. <laughs> right. I got this on video. They were arguing, <laughs> right? and I just went up to them. I was like, guys, come on. What are we doing? <laughs> That's really funny. That's fucking great. <laughs> they were not oh, feeling it. They didn't like it. I thought I was going to break the tension. <laughs> Me too. Start cracking up. Yeah. She started crying. He started fucking like, what the Dude, fuck? Dude, my hilarious. favorite <laughs> couple fights, it's coming up, is Santa Con when it's in the city. You know, everyone dresses up as Santa and yeah. gets blackout drunk. Yeah. You see a lot of couple fights at night. If you go out to do spots mm-hmm. in the city, you'll see people dressed as like elves arguing with Santa. Mm-hmm. Just oh, yeah. crying with puke. Oh, dude, everyone's puking. There's mm-hmm. like there's fight compilations the day after SantaCon every year because it's just drunken Santa. idiots dressed up as Santa Claus and reindeer and they're all just beating each other <laughs> up in the street. I find alcohol makes you slightly unreasonable. Mm. In general. Good take. Not me. I like the uh, new the new costume I saw this year where you know the costumes you step in and your legs are the person. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There was one where it was a kidnapper oh, and the kid had it on and the kid, it looked like the guy was just grabbing a kid oh, and the no, kid I, kept holding onto a pole. I saw the video you're talking about. Yeah. It was an alien oh, was an that alien. had a kid and he was like, they're taking me and, he kept, and the kid was doing funny. the thing like yeah. he was trying to grab on. It was very funny. Those those things are great where you get in and it's like your legs but a different body. Yeah. I thought you literally meant like a Hamas kidnapper and I was like, that's, that's hardcore. You know, guys, there's two sides to every story. Damn. No, there's not. Lewis yeah, there does, is. Lewis What's the other to, side? Lewis doesn't want to. I work. don't think Israel's exactly as innocent as you guys are fucking pretending that they are. Listen, we're all. Too I think dumb the Jews are. We they're, can't they're, do this. They're the we common can't. denominator in every war in I'm history. You, but anyway, go ahead. Ron and I talked. I alluded to this on our podcast, and yeah. I'm still getting what. Shit. What. It's just no such good. a big subject that you're like, it's not a big subject. We know nothing us, about it. I'm saying don't pick Israel because you know nothing about it. Dan said I'm not picking, I'm not picking the Palestinians <laughs> because I don't know nothing about it. I think that they're both probably psychotic religious people yeah. who believe in sky gods and kill each other for it. You, that's crazy. You that's sound crazy like a Palestinian. Settle down. No, that's a, that's a crazy way to be. Um, don't have an incident. Are there other gods? Sky gods? Ocean god? Does like Prometheus? Who? Prometheus? Prometheus? What? That was a mo- it was a sci-fi movie. That was a sci-fi movie to lead off the Who's aliens. Who's the ocean guy? <laughs> was the Neptune's prequel. The, the alien prequel. Narcolepsy? You mean like the Greek gods? <laughs> Who's talking about? Yeah. <laughs> Who's yeah, there the, an ocean guy? Yeah, Neptune. Neptune, Neptune yeah. Zeus. Yeah, we used to eat at that diner. diner all the time. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Who knows uh, about great it? diner. Prometheus. It's a, it is no, what great. is um the Little Mermaid's dad's name? Poseidon. That. Well, Jesus wow. Christ. Are they allowed to say What, the new movie? You didn't see it? He's black in the new one. Is he? Yeah, it's Black Little Mermaid. Yeah, Pos- Black Poseidon black. does sound like a black dude's name. Yeah. Poseidon. <laughs> you go, do you know Poseidon Jones? <laughs> 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 starting, Yo, <at> left, Poseidon! <laughs> starting at left tackle for Ohio State, <laughs> Poseidon Jackson. <laughs> I'm Poseidon Jackson, the Ohio State University. But it's spelled P O hyphen side <laughs> hyphen in. You guys see Killers of the Flower Moon? Not yet. I'm where, very anybody? excited to where, see where it. Where is that? Is it great? Give me that excited. It's been out for two weeks. Oh, shut up. House faggot. No, it's a De Niro, uh, Scorsese, DiCaprio. and a uh, DiCaprio movie. Uh, haven't we seen that movie? Uh, enough, times right? Hurry up it. I mean, you, you, how are you supposed to spe- uh, suspend reality when they're in the same movie? Yeah. Wait, what's the other De Niro, week? DiCaprio movie? Yeah. The, well, uh, the Departed, uh, uh, the no, fucking no, Godfather. No, 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 no. Carlito's Way. He doesn't know what he's talking about. I'm saying, I'm with Bronx Tale. They're all the same fucking movie, dude. He uses the same. Same actors in every fucking movie. It's like enough. Mm. Use somebody else. I don't necessarily agree. Oh, uh, Bobby wanted the part <laughs> of what? <laughs> the moon. Flip <laughs> 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 it. Flip <laughs> it. I was, I was hanging up there for a while. And you guys were all going to swing at it. <laughs> Clip it now. I'm. I'm. It's killers I'm, of the flower. And it's and it's it, it's it's three uh, hours twenty six minutes. It, pretentious horseshit. I bet anything it's over two hours is for fucking. No, it's called a. It's called a piece of art. Did you I cut my microphone incredible. for me saying. F- no. 
<laughs> no, you whispered it, you idiot. Joe's Lewis is not a whisper's work. <laughs> hey, it got quieter. My voice got lower. Just <laughs> hey, someone's cutting off my mic. <laughs> Who's cutting off my mic's not on? Such hey, stop idiot. turning up the volume on my microphone. <laughs> Guys, why is this happening? Oh, someone's muting me. I'm being shadow banned. <laughs> I'm being shadow banned. Did you guys mute me while I took a sip of my coffee? <laughs> you can't silence me while I drink. Uh, was it good? I loved it. Of course you did. Yeah, it's fun. Because you you're a what? fucking the- you're like a movie nerd. No, he's the smartest one out of all of us. He is not. I, am, yes. I, I promise you, I have a higher IQ. No, than we're Joe talking List. film nope. IQ, cinema IQ. That's Joe, not a real thing, Joe List. Of course it is. <laughs> yes, it is. Of course, cinema it is. IQ. Joe yes. List is the smartest person in. He is Bob, not the fucking uh, smartest. I bet Bobby's got a better cinema IQ. <laughs> Four of us. Well, I, did, I was on your Cinnabon. side. That was good. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> fucking dirty Puerto Rican. Whoa. Sorry. Whoa. We Whoa. Call, Whoa. Calm we, down, fucking Israel. We call them <laughs> Island Hamas now. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I am definitely smarter than Joe. No, you're not. Here's you know, I'll tell you why. I'll Here's tell you why. Can I tell you, tell you why? I'm going to tell you the ranking Can I say why, though? Can I say why? Sure. Can I say why? Yeah, go ahead. Say you it. You want to do the ranking of intelligence? Yeah. If you ahead. put yourself in the middle, I'll fucking slap you. No, it's gonna. It's easy. It goes Joe, me, Lewis, you. Well, you you think I'm... <laughs> first of all, if I'm the dumbest one... I just wanted to make you... Uh, okay. You got, you, got me. you got me. You got me. You got me. Dumbest. <laughs> dumbest. I mean, I think, I think, I think you just dumbest. dumbest. My, uh, my eyes are just... starting to hurt. Dumbest. <laughs> Me, I think he's taking no, I'm the not title. the dumbest. I am not. Lewis the dumbest. pronounces the B in dumbest. dumbest. So <laughs> the dumb best. No, I'm the dumb best. I'm the best of the dumb. I think Lewis uh, might have the highest IQ. Of I might actually us. have the highest Seriously. IQ. I actually think well, the highest I think IQ. survival IQ. Absolutely. These aren't. None of these are real things. I think it's. I think it's me. There's an IQ, and that's it. You can't just throw another word. Well, what is ahead IQ? Of IQ? I think it's. Don't know IQ. I think it's Lewis, me, and it's fucking Joe, and then Dan. Call me the dumbest. Yep. I'm the only one in here with a college degree. Yeah, but it did d- nothing the- with it. That's Point why you're proven. dumb. Yeah, dumbass. Dumb. Dumbass. Dumb. Yeah, you think that's yeah. smart. Stupid yeah, you're ass. Still smart. Debt. Stupid. Right. Well, look at that. He's realizing how dumb he is. You it all off. Yeah. Stupid Uh-oh. ass. Stupid right. They're about to, they're about to uh, get, just relieve college debt, dummy. I'm the only one that has zero post-high school education. Damn it. Zilch. He's right. Zilch. That makes me... The smartest. You might be the smartest. Zilch. You look, also look like your name dumb. could be Zilch. Damn Not it, I am the dumbest. Second. Yeah, we're sitting right next to you and we did nothing. God damn it, I yeah. am the dumbest. Yeah. But, the, I, no, one but what about of that education. piece of paper on my mom's wall? <laughs> and burn it. Fuck. Fuck you, U of A. Yeah. I, I did a year and a half of college after high school. That's embarrassing. I did two. Did you get an associate's? Uh, two classes away, English, Why basic you... English and basic math. Can you go? Because I and found get it? the love of comedy. Can you go back and get it? I like can. A, like a older woman that yeah. had a kid. Yeah, I, I think I can. <laughs> Please, can you? And it's you in just... fine arts. It's not in. It's associates in fine arts. I could be a, an art teacher at a, like a boys and girls club. God, that'd be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, might have to do it. Yeah, let's go back to school. Yeah, I'm the smartest. What is that's that's a, got, That'd be a great show, though, if all four of us went back to go school. Go back to school. Yeah, got I'd, a trade. I'd Dude. go get a second degree. I get kicked out for raping a girl in <laughs> week two. Whoa. <laughs> but then you, but you're also, you get kicked out of school, but also into a frat for Yeah. <laughs> but what is IQ exactly? We all use IQ as the thing of smartest, but does sure. anyone know what IQ really is? Yes. I legitimately uh, don't know. It's called, it stands for Intercontinental Championship. That's not, Inter-qu- that's IC. Intercontinental. <laughs> the- oh, there we go. IQ, I'll, I'll read it since no one else is fucking reading. IQ is a type of Joe, standard. Dan, Dan, Joe, Dan, can, can I talk to you real quick? Yeah, you bet. This morning specifically, mm-hmm. you've been very aggressive and mean. It's afternoon, dummy. Oh, wow. what I mean. what happened dude, Joe? you are not the smartest. He had you can't a even baby. Recognize what? the time of day. Dan, 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 he had a baby this week. Okay. Well, and when, la- uh, we all know week. me, Lewis. We know what that's like. You get a little edgy, sure. Mm. A little. Our life IQ is substantially higher than oh, Dan's. We life understand life. love, yeah. dog. Absolutely. Love and life. Yeah, he yeah. picks up Shih Tzu poop. A Shih Tzu? What? I don't Whatever know a dog Shih Tzu. you have. She's a terrier. All right, same thing. She's a snuggle it's, bug. Yeah. <laughs> she's Sixty pounds. <laughs> and, and she's, 60 pounds? Yeah, she's that's a, a big dog, dog yeah, right? Dan dog. has no responsibility. I just said I have a dog. It's not a responsibility. You don't yeah? Let me just let it go. Let me just fucking not. You yeah. could, and nobody yeah. would. Let me tell you something. Somebody you else could, would find it, you and could, they would love that next You could let it go, and, and nobody would fucking, nobody would say anything to you. I, would, I, would, I was driving on the street the other day. You can't day, do that with Jersey, a kid. like late yeah. at night. Right? I, I made the right the highway, choice. And I saw a dog, like just a fucking 
like a big dog, and it was like running down the highway long, and I was like, fuck, dude, this dog's gonna get killed. Yeah. And then I, I stopped and I tried to get the dog. And I was like, and in my mind, I was like, dude, this is gonna become my dog. Like I'm gonna yeah. rescue this dog. Which that gonna, is how most of the time that goes. It's gonna jump in the I car. Hope it's a coyote. Have him. Yeah. <laughs> I hope Lewis goes, come here, little buddy. It's like just fuck. <laughs> a fucking 15 of them come out of the woods. James James <laughs> comes, James comes out, he goes, yeah. Hey dad, the, yeah. the new dog in the garage <laughs> bit me yeah. again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Lewis L- Lewis wire. fights it with little nips that he smashes in his fist. <laughs> yeah. He, I love that like, movie. Yeah, that's so funny. <laughs> I'm going to go out and feed the dog. <laughs> it breaks the small bottles. By the way, would a, would a film cunt whatever the fuck love that film? Because I saw the movie twice. Liam Neeson, The Gray. It was a great, it was a great that movie. That movie ruled. It was a good movie. Was yeah. It? Didn't see it. It's fun. Didn't see but that doesn't it make you dog. the smartest. He fights wolves. Because I'm not you, makes me the smart, but yeah. you're calling me a, a film cunt, whatever. I didn't. He called you a film cunt. Yeah, you did. Uh, but I like Liam Neeson. I like. Cuntosaurus. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's the bitchiest of all the dinosaurs. <laughs> <laughs> it's always had its period. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it. Yeah, knowing Goodbye. film is not a. It's not a quality I fucking like. Yeah. What's your favorite movie? Of all time. I bet it's going to be stupid. Oh it's going to be some pretentious, it's gonna be like pretentious horse. He's going to be like, oh, shit. you've never seen On the Waterfront? Yeah, dude, pick a fun movie like we all do, dude. Yeah. Say Aladdin. Yeah, it's Goodfellas, you dummy. Goodfellas. It is. Is your favorite? Of course. All right, I'll give it to him. Also, that, by the way, this is a, something I take a lot of pride in. I get called a film cunt snob asshole, and, and I get bag. called don't forget, and bag. I get called a fucking retard who doesn't know art, doesn't understand art, which is the way you want to be. Right smack in the middle. Hmm. I also get called a left wing <laughs> liberal cuck retard and an alt right fucking. Yeah, that's lunatic. where you want to be. So I, I'm very proud of those things. Yeah, and what's your favorite? Nobody movie? likes you. That's your, that's your, oh, what's your favorite that's movie? That's your point. Nobody yeah. likes you. Nobody. Both sides agree. <laughs> I suck. Nobody that that's doesn't exactly know me likes me. That I will say. Be. What's your favorite movie? Boogie Nights. It's a Goodfellas ripoff. Okay. It's not. It's not a great movie. Okay. It's fine. I don't give a flying you know, it's not fuck a great what movie. either I, one of you all right, say. Dude, I, don't great. get angry. I like the You know, movie. it's not a great movie. I watched it again recently. Oh, uh, this is going to be a bad take. I uh, know it. The Godfather? Star Wars. Below. Blow? Blow? Uh, yeah. Blow was Blow not me. good. Blow was trash. Oh, Blow. I think you said Below. Blow oh, Blue. What's your, blow. Fa- what's your favorite movie? <laughs> that was fun. I, I think so it's generic to say, but I think Shawshank Redemption. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck was that, Joe? What about, what about you? Well, you know, it's just as hack as Goodfellas. It's what just. <laughs> I'm, fucking, uh, I'm gonna go across the table oh, and smack Joe oh. in his new dad mouth. Yeah. Good luck. Yeah. Uh, True Romance. Really? True Romance, a fucking great film. One yeah. of the greatest scenes of all time. You just like because Tarantino what, wrote that says, scene. Yeah. Huh? Tarantino wrote that. He thing. wrote it, and Tony Scott directed it. Who's yeah. fun? Who of killed one himself? Great. Yep. Great. Great movie. Look, Shawshank. You know. No, Shawshank rules. It's a classic. Good, Boogie Nights rules. All four of these movies yeah, fucking they're good, rule. They're good movies. Yeah, these are great movies. Boogie Nights. By the way, all 90s movies. How about that? 90s is the best era of all time. That's interesting. Uh, Why do you say that's interesting? Well, it's just that all four of us pick movies from the same decade. Oh, I thought you were talking about uh, 90s. With What's your favorite? Oh, well, 70s and all 90s right, are right, the two favorite, best decades. Favorite comedy of all time? Um, I don't know. I mean... Vacation, uh, I mean, Christmas Vacation, Naked Gun, Dumb and Final Dumber, Tap, Dumb is, and Dumber. Those are the five for me. For I, me, it, oh, do you got Christmas five? Vacation is more like a. It's not funny. It's the yes, you're it's, out of your it's, mind. It's, 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 incre- it's incredible. incredible. You're out of your mind. Hilarious. Give me, give me eight laugh out loud moments. Oh, oh Jello of the month. Why That's the eight? gift that keeps on giving. I mean, his shitter's face, full. Goes, you can just go cut it. No, 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 no. Like, look, the, the funny, the laugh out loud was when the cops break in. I know this is like a subtle thing that people don't even talk about. They're all like partying because yeah. the, the boss says they're going to give him the, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the, the, the raise. Yeah, they're, they're going to give him the bonus anyway. So they're all like just you know, celebrating, and the cops break in. They're like, everyone freeze. And the wife, Beverly, is holding Clark's dick <laughs> when they freeze. <laughs> and then the sound, the sound when she puts it back on his dick, and yeah. she shakes hands with the wife. Puts it back on the, it's amazing. <laughs> That's, yeah. what, That's like the 70s best know, joke in the movie. You don't even movie. notice that. Until you're an adult, you don't even really notice it. It's yeah. fucking great. I think Napoleon Dynamite, wow. funny movie. Very, Very funny. funny. Very you funny you thought it was about ice cream. That's why you... Rented it. What? I don't even get it. You thought I was Neap- he, Neapolitan. He, he, Neapolitan, and it's not even the same. Oh. I mean, I mean, wow. No, I don't even. Max left. He, he left because it was Max so is bad. Retarded. Uh, no, Christmas vacation is um, unbelievable. When he goes to hit spin the little thing and it just falls into pieces, yeah. it's amazing. Him trying to put it. It's amazing. I like MacGruber. Yes, uh, MacGruber was a yes. fucking great movie. MacGruber makes Most me laugh. Underrated. I mean, so hard. Underrated. It Most underrated me... movie comedy movie of all time makes me laugh. So MacGruber. Weird. No. Is this a pause? Yes. Uh, oh. It was I got somebody I got just muted me. I got a camera. 
most underrated comedy movie of all time. Walk Hard, the Dewey Cox. Show. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. I yeah, can't smell. I, 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 I can't smell. So it's my movie. I, dude, I. Love I've it. never seen it. Oh my God, it's, I've kidding? never seen it. It's the best parody. I'll watch it tonight with you. It's the best parody of a biography Naked? movie. It's yeah. Right. It's dude. It's slapstick. It's so. You know what's stupid. another underrated movie that no one talks about? And I've been bringing this up as much as I can. The other guys. Yeah, I just Great watched movie. it the other day. It's funny. We I talked would, about it in Nate's green room. Yeah, I would Where say you. The, uh, is that the one uh, with Marky City. Mark, right? Where? Radio City. Oh, I wasn't there. Is that the one with Marky Mark? Yeah, with Will funny. Ferrell and uh, Mark Wahlberg. It's a funny movie. And it's Adam McKay. I, I love that The Rock and Sam Jackson die at the beginning. It's it great. fucking great. Now, here's an outside the was box. Was I supposed to go to Radio City? Am I an asshole for not supporting No, me? I was out of town. Did you go to SNL? No. Uh, you didn't would... go to Radio City or SNL? Well, I thought going to SNL would be like, it seemed like a desperate f- move. Be like, Nate, can I get tickets for SNL? I what are like, you talking about? Why? He's your friend. He's, the, God, no, he's the godfather of your What kid. are you talking about? It's weird. No, it's not. No, I'm going to ask him for it. Yes. If he wanted me to be there, he would have said, hey, dude, come to SNL. No, no, people are asking he's, for He's not doing that, dude. See, this it, is was what actually, it was actually showed you how close you were if you went to the taping. No, I texted him, and I was no, like, congratulations, and he gave it a thumbs up. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's a dick move. You go, congratulations, Nate goes, oh, buddy. I'll see. He gave an emoji. Who is this? He goes, oh. new phone. Who oh, is that's this? crazy. Live <laughs> from new New phone. It's live from New York. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, he gave it a heart, not a thumbs up. Thumbs up is a passive aggressive thing that you like. If you do a thumbs up, I do it a lot. I take that as fuck your mother. <laughs> really, yeah, dude. Oh, I'm gonna be thumbs up on you on everything on you anything, say, dude. Give me a thumbs up. I dare you. I I, I stay giving thumbs up. <laughs> But don't you think also he probably was extremely overwhelmed with 5,000. That's what it was. So he's no, probably not, going through to, you know. I'm not offended. I'm like, you know, it yeah. is what it is. I just, you know. I didn't, well, it was great. I didn't change, you went? I didn't yeah. change my life to go be a part of his thing. You went? Yeah. I went and watched him tape. Did you ask for tickets or did he give you the tape? No, I asked Nate. You I called like, him up and said, can I go? I go, I want to watch you. Ta- I want to go to the tape. And he said, okay, I got you. Yeah. I sat there and watched it. It was fucking awesome. Wow. It was really cool. I've never been to an SNL taping before. I went to once. It was great. Me too. It was really cool. I've I thought it was been. uncomfortable. Really? I don't know, just standing. So who were you standing? I was standing like on the side. Oh, no, I, I sat in, I didn't the, seat. I sat in the crowd. Yeah, oh, I, I got a seat. Would you sneak in? No. What, were you, no, pull, no, no. What, you it, pulling ropes? Yeah. If Nate really wants me to be his friend, he should give me $1 million right now. This what? is crazy. It means what? nothing to him. It means nothing. He has it's, a house that's literally for his podcast equipment. He has two houses. Just on another the, house. He has two houses on the same block. You should have one is him. One is for his podcast equipment. Remember when you convinced me not to go with Nate, I, you I, fat cunt? I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked you. Know, I could have went clean, dude. Uh, oh, my uh, God. Fucking, Lewis right now would be like, you guys ever noticed when you go to get butter <laughs> and then you think it's cake? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> you've got an incredible arena. <laughs> <laughs> now, can I? Thank you, all thirty thousand of oh. you. Wow, gentlemen! Real quick, let's take a moment and thank MyBookie.ag for being a supporter of the show. We love MyBookie. If you guys like sports, if you like to gamble, MyBookie has you taken care of because they really have every sport you could imagine. They have the best odds on the planet, and they have so many fun things like cash bonuses that are no strings attached that allow you to deposit and withdraw quickly. It's such a great platform for gambling. I love it. I use it all the time. NFL is back, college ball is here, and they have a brand new cash out system that gives you options to bet and win all season long. I like betting on the fights. I, I, I mean, let me tell you something, dude. If you would have bet on Nganu taking Fury the distance, you would have made so much fucking money through my bookie. Right now, all you got to do is go to mybookie.ag, and when you check out, use the promo code REGS on your first deposit of $50 or more, and you can receive up to $200 in cash instantly credited to your MyBookie account. That's R E G Z REGS. To claim your cash bonus now. You can bet anything, anytime, anywhere, only with my bookie. All right, where were we? Can I say an outside the box? Back, back to underrated comedies. Yeah. This is going to be an outside the box pick. Please. Yeah. Dan's going to support me because he's nice. And you guys are going to shit all over <laughs> this. Why do you're you gonna say go. that? Why are you going to be negative? Because I, I know you guys. I'm what, predicting. You, you don't know us. We, I, I'll, I'll probably I don't be know on your you. side. I, I know you. You know me, but I'm going to be on your side. Here's what I'm I just say. really Lewis appreciate you calling like, me. Lewis is going to be like... I just really appreciate you calling let's me nice. Say, what, nice. What am I underrated oh, comedy. Because oh, you're going to say it's not underrated. Oh, let's say. But I'm going to make a case that what, it is what, underrated. What is Lewis going to do again? Good. <laughs> underrated comedy. Borat. <laughs> nobody. I think, I, think it's, I think it's rated. Nobody it's ever says, "Oh <laughs> my god!" You never. When people say their favorite comedies, no one says Borat. That movie is so fucking funny. It's funny. Uh, Genuine uh, chocolate face, no makeup. I do. Oh uh, yeah. I mean, there are the. <laughs> That's lines. one of the funniest lines of all time. It is, it is laugh out loud funny. It's crazy it's how funny it is, funny. and it's somehow, a funny movie. Why would you think we wouldn't but, think that? It's, funny? No, it's not a real movie. People are gonna say it's not overrated. Like, it's not a real movie. 
It, it, so for but me, a, a mockumentary literally is, doesn't make any sense. Nah, it's a mockumentary, and mockumentaries <laughs> which aren't is a real movie. Spinal Tap's not a real movie. Mm-hmm. What? Why is a mockumentary not a well, movie? Well, Spinal Tap doesn't use people that aren't in on it. Everyone no. on Spinal Tap is in on the It's movie. like a TV show in the form of a movie. I just, it's chess. I understand the reason. So what is it? What is it, a song? Fuckface. It's a painting? <laughs> it's, he said it's chess. Uh, what is it, a what? fucking it it sports? Sense. Yeah. The fuck are you talking it's about? It's a vibe. <laughs> what is it, a wheelchair? Borat is a vibe, bro. <laughs> it's not a movie. What's it, a political group? What are <laughs> yeah. you talking about? It's a movie. That's not a movie, really. But, it's a Ford but truck. <laughs> do you see my... Borat is the new car <laughs> Do you from see my Chevrolet. point, though? It's its own universe. <laughs> <laughs> the Borat it's universe. It's such an It's idiot. so good, people don't even <laughs> think of you it. Know they what? skip over it. And this no one be- ever says Borat is one of the funniest movies. Because it's be, it's besides, I, I understand what he's saying, though. It's not a, 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 a typical scripted movie that they wrote jokes and people acted It's about. hard for me to put it in the same category. That's uh, uh, why it's, I think we're agreeing. That's why it's underrated. I think we actually are making a similar point. Sure, yes. People don't talk about it like it's one of the funniest movies when it is one of the funniest movies. But just like, uh, whatever, Bad Grandpa with fucking, um, you know, well, or road, tri- road Trip with Eric Andre was, uh, yeah, they were all great, but it's, like, it's, it's, to compare that, that to called. like, not you know, uh, fucking National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, it's hard to, like, put them in the same category. Yeah, like Airplane, they sat down and wrote oh, those jokes. Fucking boo. Yeah. They, they had hidden Excuse cameras me? and they, they pranked I'm people. I'm sorry. I said boo. To the movie Airplane. No, airplanes in general, he, they don't, he doesn't fit in yeah, this. I fit now, now <laughs> stupid. He yes. hates he goes, flying. I yeah, that mo- The name of the movie should have been, we, we <laughs> ran out of second seatbelts, <laughs> and now you got to feel bad. Eh, fuck you, big head. <laughs> they should call it I, Uncomfortable I Way to I Travel. I, I mean, it's funny at the time, but it's 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 silly. It, there's a couple yeah. funny things in it, but it's not a... Gr- it's not a Dark. No. Huh? Naked, do you not like Naked Guns? Nope. No, Naked Gun rules. Oh, they fall down the stupid stairs? Yeah, it's so funny. It's what? No, Naked Gun. Naked I, I, Gun has some of my favorite jokes of all time. Name yeah. one. The one where he's the where he's the umpire and he starts calling strikes and he notices the crowd goes nuts. So he keeps getting fucking crazy. <laughs> he when does he calls the whole thing. <laughs> he fucking No, it's amazing. Nuts. Yeah, you're out of your tits. <laughs> Leslie Nielsen just was kind of funny no matter what he was. Oh, uh, Dracula dead and loving it? Dude, uh, you see, what? Re- repossessed? Yeah. The parody of The yeah. Exorcist? I didn't, the like, I didn't like any of those fucking movies. I didn't like any of them. I thought they were stupid. Well, you're stupid. You're dumb. You're dumb. Fuck you, dumb dumb. Fuck you, airplane rules. What are you doing? What? You're at the watch? What's wrong? It says dawn. I'm looking at your fucking, your, the dawn on your finger. All right. I thought it said dude. The dawn. It does. Dude, it's dude. I got dude. I'm married to dude. 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 <laughs> dude do you take the I, I, I just don't like the movies. I think they're, I mean, they're fine, but it's not laugh out loud. Do you take this woman to be your lawful letter wife? I did. I did. <laughs> I, thought, I thought MacGruber was funnier. But Gruber's a funnier, edgy. I like edgy. That's Damn, like you're sil- so dark. That's like silly shit. I like a little edge to it. I like a little, you know, sex and crazy shit. Those they are just a, silly. They had a whole joke about the pilot fucking boys in Airplane. Yeah. Do you but- watch Gladiator, that whole joke? That was about him wanting to fuck the little boy. Yeah, I didn't talk about fucking boys. I was talking about fucking I thought, females. I, I didn't know that was edgy. your thing. I didn't know that was your I thought thing. You liked edgy I didn't shit. know you fucking boy humor was your thing. Can I say, funny. dude, can I say in the 90s, gay wasn't edgy. Gay was gay. Yeah, gay was gay back then. This is it. Well, the that's 90s crazy. Yeah, the 90s, 90s, dude. And can I say this? Kid fucking wasn't edgy back then. Well, it's in the 70s, so. Whatever. That and it's always way. been edgy because it's disgusting. Kid fucking wrong. was edgy <laughs> in the 70s. Yeah, get about. that in. How do you know? You don't even have a kid. Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah, you don't, don't have a kid. You wouldn't know. Yeah, you don't even know the plight of what it's like to, to have to force yourself to not have sex with your own child. <laughs> okay, Every that's day, right, folks. Right. <laughs> you go, that's our I can't, and I accept that. <laughs> the first two, three years, they didn't even got memories. You go, oh, man. Jesus Christ, Lewis. There's almost no downside. All right, don't fucking triple down on it. I do love that Nate joke where he talks about taking his daughter to Disneyland and they're like she's two she doesn't remember he goes what do you want me to do just lock her in a closet and every wait, wait. do you remember that no okay <laughs> we get it you're friends with Nate yeah it That's was great good. god we were at SNL and we were just, I opened for Nate did you hear this story no we, I went to the Radio City to see uh, Nate <coughs> excuse me COVID and uh, we're all hanging out. He's not joking. He does. You have COVID. Yeah. I no longer have it. Dude, if I had up it, my it's fight, lingering. Dude, I just got my fucking oh. AIDS test back. 
Negative. Don't <laughs> yeah. fuck with me, dude. Don't I don't have it. Me, <laughs> Look who's all afraid of COVID. Mr. Right. Tough Guy. Ooh. No hep C. Uh, it no doesn't hep B. No HIV for me, baby. Yeah, that was pretty good. Clip that. Uh, <laughs> clip that was that. fun. I think we got Lewis's new saying. <laughs> so I, I went. We a new catchphrase. <laughs> I went to Radio City, saw Nate. Can I get another coffee for one of these retards? Yeah, let's send. I was no, just saying. Around. Around. Fucking no, retards. they're around. Send no, the special around. kids. No, they're around. You know what? four of them there. Why do we have four? producers if you're gonna go they want to be here if you're gonna go get coffees let me get a from starbucks a medium a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew Ooh. i want the exact same thing don't forget hey to hey, hey. give this back to me let's go last Doggy. week you didn't give it back to this me. this time tell them instead of not putting any sugar-free vanilla just do one pump and then if they put in one pump and you go is that really one pump maybe put in two danny do you need my order again or do you want me to say it his I'll name is danny you. and i'll take a text. chocolate brownie i'll text, I'll text you if I'll text you, dog. Ch- chocolate brownies all around. No, on I don't want to. Cho- I don't want a chocolate brownie. I'm keto. Yeah, keto, Kalen. I got a fucking I fight. Are you excited, excited about dude. your fight? I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited to get it over with. Hey, well, when this Ooh, airs, it's already done. Mindset. When this airs, this airs Tuesday. So this will be will done. Happened. So I think you. Congratulations, won. Lewis. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The fights this weekend. Fights yeah. Saturday. Oh yeah. I'll I get for, you guys. I forgot that I'm going to be in Phoenix at Stand Up Live, just but dominating audience. It's okay because first of all, the pay per view starts shit. at three o'clock. <laughs> pay per view starts at three. It'll be over by like eight at the latest. It's three hours earlier there, so you, you literally from noon to five, just chill and watch the fights. For real? Yeah. I'm going to do that. I know you are. Is it going to be good uh, coverage, though, it? or is it going to be like a... Lou, where do I... Min Comedy's doing it. They fucking do a great job. Do I just go to MinComedy.com? Uh, CarnivalCombat.com to get the pay-per-view, right. but Min Comedy's... Uh, Dude, I'm going to tell you right now on Saturday, I'm going to get high in my hotel room and watch comics. Fight. I'm going to be at the Boston Garden. I'm going to put it up in the... Uh, in the, uh, the Jumbotron? Yeah, I'm going to put it in the... During what? the, during the show. Go, fuck it, I don't want to watch these fucking silly clowns. There's dudes fighting. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, we can all agree, go Bruins. Yeah, Bruins are kicking ass. Hey, can we? Uh, Lewis is going to win, right? Yeah. Yes. yes. I love Tim Butter. I love Tim. I don't know Tim, but I can't imagine I love somebody Tim. beating Lewis. I love Tim, but this is <laughs> this serious. is this is what Lewis has. This, this is the this, best shape he's ever been in. This is Lewis's so, yeah. pure focus. Is dominance. I feel good. Can is we throw a joke in boxing? somewhere? What? It, we got to throw a joke in somewhere. Is it boxing? Boxing, yeah. Oh. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah. What do you think? He's not going to win boxing? Yeah, Tim Butterley's a two-time Golden Gloves champion. No, he's not. He doesn't even have a box. That? No, he's a he's a kung fu guy. So you know, no, you're not, not. He's not a Golden Gloves champion. He's a middleweight Philadelphia Golden Gloves champion. No, he was not. He was, go eight, check eight it. Eight 1998. Years ago. It was no, it was eight years ago. Eight. He was. Yeah, dude, he's oh, fucking shit. good. He makes this noise when he punches. I gotta go take my bet back. He goes. <laughs> That's how he punches. How does Lewis? How does Lewis punch? <laughs> Don't fight! Punch! Yeah. Punch! Punch! Baby James! <laughs> Baby James! Do you want another? Coffee? I will be somebody. <laughs> do you want another coffee? Uh yeah, he's getting me one. No, they just asked. I remember when. Yeah, I, I remember did. when I lost my. Mind. Well, do you want to hear the story? I said that in my head. It was an old Patrice line that he said to. You remember Romy Rome? Yeah. Remember that com- comic Romy Rome? No. It's like this. I mean, he was around like maybe fifteen years. He's probably still around. Black guy, like good-looking black kid. Yeah, I remember him. And he used to wear like a like shiny belt buckles. Yeah. And Patrice one time said to him, he was like, "Romy, why are you always dressing all? I remember when I remember when I lost my mind." <laughs> <laughs> it's such a hilarious ball bust. <laughs> He's dead. Yeah. Um, how are you doing? I got a story. You want to hear the story? Yeah, go ahead. I got a good Nate funny story. Yeah. So you're opening for him. I went to. Well, that's the, that's you're burying the you're doing the. You already said that. you buried the lead. Yeah, you did. You said I opened. Yeah, you said that. Did I? Yeah, yeah you did. I opened the story. Right. But anyways, Radio City. All right, so I went to Radio City to see Nate hanging out. Great hang. Missed all three of you guys. I don't know where you guys were. I was on the road. All right, I was there. seething in my jealousy. I was headlining somewhere myself. Yeah, it was a Sunday. So yeah, are oh, you work Sundays? I was probably home with my child. There you go. Uh, so we were on Radio City, <laughs> hanging out. Not a great comedy. How is room, he by still the way. here? It's fucking crazy. What are you talking about it's crazy. He's still Who are you here. He's about? gone. He left. That's not the same that's one. Different that's different they look guy. the same, you idiot. That's really? a different. Yeah, yeah they have a autism. Whole different guy. Whole different, different guy. guy. Yeah. Oh, they all wear person. flannel and jeans, and they have the same eyebrow yeah. that connects. Yeah, they're Bobby's foot soldiers. Yeah. yeah. So they're all dressed the same. Natalie also dresses like them as well. Exactly. <laughs> that's because she doesn't want to get raped. Like it's like in a zombie movie where you wear the zombie skin so they don't eat you. <laughs> I got tell you a story. Oh, Jesus, come on! It's you the worst how, podcast you, for stories. You know yeah. how the show. Well, you should know that. We go back. We go back. You can't back. tell a story. We're back. Go ahead. So I see Nate. We're all hanging out. Great hang. Everybody. Everybody. Who, anybody who's anybody is there. You okay, know I don't I mean? like that. We it's got. We got this bit, the, 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 We stink. We're not there. We got it. Yeah. Okay. Can't move. On. The reason you can't get the story out is we had me. 
So we're sitting there. I'm about to have a kid in 10 days, and I'm done. I'm off the road. I'm finished. And Nate says, we're doing Seattle next weekend. Eddie Vedder is coming. He's friends with Eddie Vedder, this guy. Nate is? Yes. Eddie, from Eddie V's Prime Seafood? Yeah. And, uh, you kidding me a table? Yeah. <laughs> The guy that created Surf and Turf. No yeah. fucking yeah. way. The guy who created the uh, the uh, crab fried rice. Oh, I was going to say this before, dude. Because oh, really? uh, I got distracted. Side oh, note, we all got distracted. I told James Seasons 52 is like better than Capital Grill. Of what, The Simpsons? S- what? Season 52. That was good. That was great. Seasons That's a nerd joke. Seasons I love the it. The nerd joke. I love it. Keep going. Seasons 52 is a restaurant, but it's like a shittier version of Capital. It's the same chain, like the same umbrella company sure. owns all of them. Uh-huh. So I tried, I, I told James, I was like, dude, season 52 is where it's at, dude. And then he came in and he was just like, this is not as good as the Capital Grill Dad. What are you talking about? Dude, he walked in and was like, yeah. <laughs> he's not feeling it at all. He did anyway. Gordon, he Gordon Ramsay did. He's like, this is trash. If you take the alcohol from an alcoholic, all you have is ick. All right, get back to you. I'm gonna Speaking of Ick, go yeah. back to your story. This <laughs> terrible story. So Nate <laughs> says, I'm, you know, I'm a big Pearl Jam guy. I've seen him 56 times. I'm gay. So Nate says, Eddie's coming. You can, if you want to come, you can meet Eddie, hang out. See you Get to meet Eddie and hang out. Is I'm gay your thing or Mark's thing? <clears throat> it's our thing. Okay, go ahead. Yeah. So... <laughs> we go there, and I go, well, I don't know, the baby, what to have a baby, you know, uh, we're going out there, I don't want to be, I can't be leaving, but it's Eddie Vedder, it's exciting, yeah. and uh, I go, well, maybe I'll go to Seattle just to meet Eddie Vedder, I don't know, you get to meet him, and Nate goes, well, I'll fly you out, first class, put you up, five-star hotel, the whole thing, and I'll pay you to do the show, so you can do seven minutes clean, which I'm not thrilled about, and uh, he pays Pretty handsomely. I'm sure. More than anyone else, any other big star I've ever opened for. I'll just say that. <laughs> so I go, uh, all right, let me talk to the wife. More she than goes, Louis? That's not what I said. Oh, I'm not yeah, a big star. Sorry. That's yes, not what is. I said. I'm not a yes, big star. Is. Relax. And I pay pretty well. Not you, you heard it here not first. You. Louis C.K. does not pay his openers <laughs> as much as Nate Bargetzi. Louis C.K. <laughs> technically also raped Joe List. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> if you really consider it. Okay. <laughs> that was between us. <laughs> Some shit I say to you, and then you just say it on the fucking podcast. <laughs> yeah, settle down. It's a okay. fuck. We'll cut that out. Don't worry. About yeah. That. Can we please? It's fucking. Louis had Joe. This is why. You know what I mean. This is why we're not closer. I secretly tell you that Louis C.K. <laughs> raped me, C. and then you just say it on a podcast. Any farts? <laughs> I talk to Sarah. I go great. We're yep. going. I'm going out. What did me? What was Eddie the talk? Vedder. Now hold on. What was the talk with Sarah like? Was what? she like? Well, this is the thing. Is Sarah? She's about to have a baby. She's like, Joe. Uh, it hurts so much. Uh, uh, your cum grew a person in me, and now I'm in pain. Well, first of all, I want to say this about Sarah Talamash. Sarah Talamash made every pregnant woman I've ever seen, met, or heard of look like a whiny cunt. Sarah, you just call my wife a whiny. That's cunt? right. Yep. Oh my God! Sarah, your baby clip mama. it and send it to her. No. <laughs> Sarah didn't. She never cried. She never went like, "I can't go up the stairs." Yeah. She never had a. That's because uh, your you baby doesn't have bones. Yeah, your baby's a little <laughs> nerd. Just <laughs> slipped right out like a fucking uh, miss. I don't know how to tell you this. You had a beanie baby. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> They're all we had real children. <laughs> 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 your only son is, a child. A child <laughs> with shoulders. Yeah. Yeah. Our, is, our child had a chin and <laughs> your son is and, filled with these small white balls. <laughs> yes. He's only missing a jawbone. Yeah, you had a pillow baby. He's got all. All the this, other bones. You had a four <laughs> ounce throw pillow. Your your child see through, Miss. <laughs> He's a bad. You had a fucking tadpole. You fucking. It slid out because it had no <laughs> arms or legs yet. <laughs> a fucking you created through meiosis. You have prick. What is it? Meiosis. Oh god oh, damn it! Well, Lewis. I think we got someone on the bottom of this. Bomb Dana. The... Where's the bomb Dana? <laughs> we don't even have a bomb Dana. Where the damn fuck dude. is it? Because Lewis ate it last time. <laughs> Where's the bomb uh-huh, Dana? You uh-huh, fucking uh-huh. idiot! Get the bomb Dana, Joe. Get off your computer. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> I love nothing, nothing more than I love the mock laughing. <laughs> well, this is the other thing about Sarah. Everybody at the hang was like, "Oh, Joe's gonna get divorced now. He's gotta leave. She's having a baby in six days." Sarah was like, "This, yeah, that sounds great. I don't." I don't care. Sarah was walking five miles the day before the baby. She doesn't need me. She doesn't love me. She doesn't yeah, the, care about me. The baby weighed three pounds. <laughs> <laughs> he was a big baby. How, how, many, how many pounds? Eight pounds, 13 ounces. What a wow. big boy. That's a big boy. Wow. Big, big old boy. Biggest baby in the, in the whole floor. But anyways, so she said, yeah, just go. So I go out there, do uh, Saturday. Well, Friday, we went and met Adam Sandler, which was very exciting. That's cool. Got, saw him. Why was the uh, Sandman there? Just to see Nate? No, he was did the uh, arena on okay. Friday night. So we all went and saw him. Great show. It was a blast. Sam Marill opened. We were late because Nate had to take a call. So I missed Sam's set. That was a bummer. Ooh. It was really awkward. Anyways, so uh, we watched Sandler. Great show. Met him. Nice guy. All the things you hear about him. 
It's Saturday. We do two shows. All exciting. We also Sunday, got to go to Washington, Oregon. Went to the UW Oregon game. Which we that were was texting about. That was a barn burn. One of the best games of the year. Blast. Dustin Nickerson got us on the field. It was unbelievable. I was watching in my hotel room, and the second I saw you were there, I was I was more jealous of that than anything you did all weekend. It was unbelievable. Men are talking about football. <laughs> yeah, so you, football. Boys, you boys uh, can talk about your. So uh, get ready because I'm about to meet this any better. story. Better fucking go somewhere. It, Joe. Football. Unbelievable. The, the setup. So, it's a lot better. of details that are unnecessary. Trim the fat. Are you familiar with Eddie? better yeah you know him best seafood (laughs) (laughs) we go sunday night here we go i've flown seven thousand miles i'm meeting eddie vetter i can't wait whenever i'm doing a live show (laughs) here we go tiny mouth (laughs) eddie vetter here's the night this is it all my life waited for this moment he cancels. Oh, he why did he come. cancel? I don't know. I think because, uh, I don't know. I'm not sure. He was sick. He was he goes, never going. He goes, wait a minute. Parts. Wait a minute. Uh, Nate does clean comedy. That shit's gay. <laughs> <laughs> you were talking Elvis. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh yeah. Oh, Elvis Joel, Rizzo. Joel is going to be there. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. Isn't his wife nine months pregnant? Uh, this this See, next song is off my my album, 10. Yeah. There you go. There so that's the story. He canceled. Damn. How <laughs> so you left you? your Woo-hoo. wife, pregnant wife, for nothing. Isn't that wild? Did canceled. You have, did you, in a sitcom, you would have to get a fake Eddie Vedder to take a picture with to not make Sarah mad? Ah. Uh, is that what you did? No. Did you just tell her you're like, he canceled? And she was like, cool. He's like, but yeah. Nate gave me $20,000 to do seven minutes. She's like, yes. So Turns out I can't how be much, clean. Was it a lot of money? It was good money. Say the number. A lot? Say the number. Just say the number. Say it. Just say it. Say it. He pays $2,000 a show. Damn. Damn. Seven minutes. Seven minutes? Yeah. That's fucking nice. And an I thought extremely it nice hotel. And a flight and a first class hotel. Flight. I thought it was gonna be more. I thought it was gonna be more. The way he said it, two thousand dollars a show. Yeah, I know. I a thought it'd be show. more. I made it'd be like four, five. It's four made... K for fucking fourteen. And these were theaters, board. by the way, not arenas. Yeah, but theaters. you have to give up your whole weekend, which you would have made more money than that. If I was working, I would have made more money than that. Yes, but yeah. it's still eight thousand dollars for fourteen minutes of for for, for twenty eight minutes all in. But I will have to shows. say this though: to do seven minutes squeaky clean it when you're you, it's not. It sucks. Because, like, shit to me is not a swear. I've been saying shit to my parents. You can't say ideas. shit? No. You can't, you can't say, say... You can't say dirty ideas. Why? No. It's clean. It's got to be clean. He has, oh. like, kids at the Nate, show. Nate has a thing. Nate's... It's coming up where I'm in Atlanta at the Buckhead Theater, and then I thought, like... I was going to tell Nate that to be like, man, eh, right? You know? do Because we're going to go to the Monday Night Football game, Dolphins-Titans. Hmm. And I was like, well, I'm in Atlanta doing the Buckhead Theater. And he goes, oh, that's crazy, man. The next night, I'm doing the arena. Oh, boy. And I was like... He's like, that's weird. We rented out the Buckhead <laughs> Theater just for my buses. He goes, oh, that's, that's where we're my... parking all the buses. He goes, that's my green room. <laughs> I just sit I keep my merch. Yeah. I keep my merch in that oh, arena great. while all I do my... Boxes. <laughs> and I really did that thing of like, I'm doing the Buckhead Theater. And he goes, I'm doing the arena the next night. And then he goes, why don't you open for me? And I go, I can't do... Seven minutes clean. I you can. can't do seven Nate, minutes clean. Nate, call me. Pits. I can. I, you could. I you could. Him, I asked him one time. He asked me to open for him. I go, yeah. I do this joke where I call crying face coming, and he goes, oh, oh my god. He goes, come on, man. Not even close. Well, face coming is not even near close. Obviously, the word come. coming. Yeah, come. The word dude. come. What's wrong dude? With and you? come That's and clean. face together. Yeah, dude. Clean. What are you, your mind? That's your cleanest joke? It's clean. <laughs> What's your cleanest joke? What is my cleanest joke? You don't have a clean joke. Ladies and gentlemen, good night. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's so hard to go. What jokes did you, did you have to take stuff out? I had to do some old stuff. And it just, it just makes you uncomfortable. To me, anytime you're doing comedy and you're conscious of having yeah, to not say do a, a word. thing, it's also hard doing seven first when you're used to doing an hour last. Yeah. It's a weird adjustment. And then you just feel like you're having bad sets but i also haven't hung out with nate in a long time you forget how fun it is to hang out with nate what was your what was your joke that you opened with Mm. what's up with the weather can't even i can't (laughs) even remember you guys like flying i think it was uh oh i did that joke about um i told a guy in the front row he looked like me and then he said oof true story that one yeah yeah it hits yeah none of my i'm just going over the the uh my the names of all my new jokes uh, hooker stuff, <laughs> loose you know pussy, funny? dead baby joke. One comic said, one comic told me this. They said, go through your set list and your bits sound like sex positions. If you do like, I've got the drone. This is fun. Now, we're, do, now we're having fun. I do the, I do the. Depressed the, chicks, cutters. I do, the, <laughs> I do the beard and mom. This isn't even a joke. My, You know what the, my joke is about cutters? Just that I hate them. 
I hate cutters. There's nothing beyond that. It's, if I see you fucking cuts on your arms, dude, it makes me so angry. But what? that's the premise. What's the... Oh, that they should finish the job. <laughs> <laughs> that's how much Fuck. I hate them. Sorry. What are some of your sex positions, Joe? Um, important recall. Yeah. Starbucks employees. I don't know if there's... Some of these don't work. Oh, Uber accident- Eats? That's funny. That's fun. Accidentally killing a baby. <laughs> that's fun. <laughs> Kids don't wear jeans. That's a funny sex that position. Fun. Uh, the make a wish space hair. That's a fun. Dick, I have Dick Doctor wax my ass. These are the best ones. Yeah, I have but, one that's just I, called the Bobby Kelly. I have oh, I have one called Fuck a Robot. There you go. Uh, it's about okay. Sarah Tolomash. This one's called Suck on Balls. All right, going guys. back down on pussy after kids. Oh, I have, I have one that's called This Bit Is Going Nowhere. <laughs> Move on. All your bitch should be called that. (laughs) That's what you get. Uh, That's what. That's what you get. That's what you get. You You dance by the fire. You're going to get a taste of flame. (laughs) (laughs) Ooh, I got burnt. (laughs) Walk around and find out the Hamas story. (laughs) Hey, we don't talk about that. All right, I was too stupid for that. Are you really on the side of the Jews? No. What are you talking about, Lewis? I don't believe in anything political. I'm apolitical. You wouldn't pick you, you if you had to pick a side. You don't. You don't know who you're on right now. I mean, there. I don't. I'm too. Stupid. We should not even do this. Don't be an idiot, Joe. Just because you. We fucking, should not even do you it. You want us watch uh, Arab babies slain? I don't want to watch it. I want to read about it. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> Joe danced in the streets when IDF bombed that hospital. Damn, dude. No. I don't want to watch it. I want to read about. No, it. No, it's a fucking horrible trap. People are here to take a break from reading about all the atrocities. Yeah. So no. let's get, the new let's get to the video, baby man. pictures. Let's do the baby pictures because I sent my baby photo to the group text and Lewis responded, ew, yeah. and I laughed for 25 minutes. We all minutes. did. We just it didn't was, write it. It was, uh, God I damn could it not, laugh. it was, right. stop laughing. Can we, do we have the baby Rancid. pictures ready to go? No, you, <laughs> I've never seen can I tell you, like can I tell you how hard you made me laugh? Like unappealing looking baby. Lewis, <laughs> oh, Lewis, I read that when I was taking my morning poop. <laughs> yeah. And the laugh got an extra little log out. Ooh. Because I was laughing in my butthole. This morning's ooh is the new but Blue Jay Okerson. I could not. <laughs> Here's stop the thing, though. The, the 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 quickness in the ooh was, was so what funny. made me laugh. It literally the photo went up, and then there was a an immediate ooh. Ew. Well, the <laughs> thing is, to a one syllable response, oof, ew, gay, yeah, yeah, all hilarious. Boo. I had some guy on YouTube. I posted a clip. You know, I, I just learned this. There are people that think a married person joking about fucking someone is like an N-word. There's people that have that. Explain. Like I posted Explain. a clip. I posted a clip where I'm talking to a woman in the front row and I was like, if my wife died, you'd fuck me, right? Very funny. And Very Joe says yes. Of you. And then some yeah. guy Who is that? What do you think? Do you oh, think? that's that's you, Dan? What do you think's the cutest boy in all the world? I mean, that is how are you holding that head up. Thanks <laughs> for throwing up cute it. baby photos right in the middle of a fucking yeah, story. Max, had a produce, dude. Max Jesus Christ. Max, hang on one Right second. in the fucking middle can you, of a can joke. You yell at him for me. Hey Max, come here. <laughs> Don't hit him. Don't hit him. No, no, no. Hey, Max, him. Max. I want to show you something. Hey, can I show you something? Max, take it off. Max, it's like, come here. A... I'm going to show you something in the other room. Max, go get my belt. Perfect time to start this other bit. Yeah, Max, <laughs> wait, till, idiot. wait till Joe I tell goes, you to bring it up. And then she says, oh, there's a picture of Hamas. <laughs> Sorry. Jesus Joe. Christ. Anyways, the guy was really offended. He's like, bro, you fucking marry? You talking about fucking a girl? This isn't funny at all. And then someone just wrote back underneath gay yeah that's funny but there's people that have that i've had this before i did karen's podcast and you know we're obviously joking about fucking lewis's ex successively and then uh, everyone's like you're fucking married your wife is pregnant you piece of shit and i'm like yeah it's I'm a kidding. joke anyways isn't that interesting yeah it it is funny that people get that fucking upset that you're clearly kidding around also who fucking like let me make it very clear i don't give a fuck if a man cheats on his wife it is so I love rare it. it's fun it is so rare that a man doesn't cheat on his wife it, that it's like, uh, what are we fucking? What type of weird thing we have? This why is it what? rare? I why did it in hospice. Why is it rare in your world? It's I thought you said hospice real quick, and I was like, that's even funnier. <laughs> that's who's rare. Who, I, no, think, they, I don't know anybody who about? cheats on his wife. I know a lot of guys who cheat. Most uh, guys cheat. Who? Not most guys. On wives? Who cheats a wife. on a wife? Right, no, most right. guys don't cheat on wives. Nah, dude. Wives, you got to be a real piece of shit. Well, let's Once settle down with that. Work, you're not a piece you got to be shit. a real fucking hunk of garbage. Hey, Calm down. Is there something you want to say? Listen, the mistakes some, are made. Sometimes you fucking... Guess, <laughs> anyways, dude, I'm going back <laughs> one more time to Tampa. <laughs> no. I'm like, that's why Bobby goes to Tampa all the time. Relax. He goes, first off, side pieces watch podcasts. Yeah, What's your you definition make, of cheating, by the way? You can make mistakes. You know what cheating is. What is cheating? If you have to ask yourself that... No, I'm just asking you a question right now. 
Do you think going to a massage parlor... And getting jerked off by Hang a, on, let me finish the sentence. And getting a full body massage... Does that include getting your penis touched? Does that include mm. getting your penis touched? Can I say, it's not cheating if you get permission. From your... My girl gave me permission for a while. She was like, you can go to Rub and Tugs. I don't care. And then I brought it up on podcast like five times. super excited about it. She's like, she was like, yeah, I'm not serious. Yeah, but you're not married. You're not married. You guys don't know. You guys don't know what life is. I'm engaged. Yeah, I'm I engaged. Yeah, into, you're engaged. He's assholes. into boys. He's into boys <laughs> banging. Is that is that cheating too? Banging boys? Yeah. Yes. Okay. No. Homo what? I'm oh, sorry. No. Sorry, dude. Sorry. Gay sex <laughs> isn't real sex. What? Well, why don't no. you tell that? That's talk. what I thought. Well, I just say I don't really. I'm not judging the man for people. cheating on his wife. How about that? Okay, that's better. I'm not judging the guy for cheating on his wife. I'm. All, I'm just interested. My assumption yeah. is that most married guys are cheating on their wives. I don't think so. I'm interested in a guy that can go on the road, fuck a woman, and then hang out with like his wife's dad. Like look her in the eye. I would cheat on the eyes. I would cheat up, on the most disrespectful thing. <laughs> How you doing? There you go. Your little baby girl is I know she's an angel. I would just be in hives. Yeah. I, I would You're I would come home. Those are herpes sores, yeah. Joe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happened. I have an outbreak right now and COVID. Uh, no, you don't. COVID and an outbreak. No, you don't. Stop yeah. Shame. Joe. <laughs> Don't come here. Why do you do this? I didn't come here. I came at my herpes? girlfriend's house. You bring your herpes and your COVID. Did you have sex while she was pregnant? Yeah, we had sex up until the last day. How often do you have herpes outbreaks? Did your boy grab your wiener? One question at a time. It feels like I just you know that finished he, coaching a Super Bowl. You know that we had sex the day Max was born? Because that's it induces labor. Yeah, the yeah. cum the yeah. cum will soften the cervix. Really? <laughs> I don't know if that's true, but Look it. It might be true. Do you Not, think they want to? Look it up, dude. The do you cum think, will soften the Do you serving, think the baby dude. catches the I, cum like a one-timer, like turn in two? Yeah, that, Dan, you don't have children. You don't know how it works. Yeah, yeah, you don't know. The cervix is closed, dude. Yeah, the bathroom. It starts fucking yeah. crowning, dude. When we Take talk about coming in hair and on stomachs, you come in. Jump right. in. You guys made three we come kids. In, we come where you're supposed right. to come. All your little offlings are going to have to face the apocalypse. Good job. Good job, Oh, I'm scared of the apocalypse. Yeah, I'm going to die in the blast radius. I'm not going to bring your baby into this world. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. Oh, bitch. World War Three is <laughs> popping off right now. I'm scared. I'm not scared at all. I just want to hold on to my money. Oh, AI is going to take over all the jobs really soon. <laughs> no, I, can't, I can't wait to watch this podcast and your kids are like, well, there won't be an internet in the apocalypse. Do you think that the AI is going to stop the internet? I think they're going to make the internet better, dude. Yeah. Wow. It's awesome, dude. I used I it know, to write it, a letter to my, my uh, son's principal. It made me sound like a fucking genius. <laughs> Dude, then it got. Then the principal got the letter. He's like, he used AI on this. The AI gave him Joe List IQ levels. I think Lewis Remember? is the smartest. I do too. If he, if that if that sperm thing, because I know there's something about it. If that's true, look it up. Come he, he softens the we're, cervix we're and old. it gets. Ready. You only know you know a certain you know a, a little you know this much a lot about this much. Uh, IQ, IQ we know is not knowledge. We know more, we know more about a lot of other things. IQ is not knowing <laughs> facts. Yeah. yeah. IQ is it, it's your it's your ability. I mean this guy I would mock it's your ability you, to would, reason it's your ability to hold on Bobby I would your ability to reason guys, and you have the lowest IQ hold on I would mop you up in trivia you yeah. know that right yeah this I, yeah right no, here trivia You're, means no 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 a wide, trivia is one thing that's not a like you know stats and trivia you know. that's it you I would if crush if, you yeah I know but guys human crazy. sperm contains a high amount of prostaglandin a hormone like well, substance that ripens the <laughs> cervix a ripe cervix is a hot way to describe <laughs> a cervix <laughs> you just got a ripe Talk cervix that bitch a cervix, cervix is ripe. Ripe. also Dude. Lewis this is just in his Puerto Rican DNA he knows something about comes and he goes baby she gets soft like a peach you come to her she's soft Dude. she's ready for the fruit it ripens out. the cervix Dude, that cervix starts to yeah. fucking pop up in like a little star yeah. that's what I I, I didn't so, know was that but I heard it and, I, and it worked. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, we <laughs> fucked that? the day the day he uh, she her water broke. Me too. Me and Beatrice yeah. banged, and this because of this show we're not together anymore. Sorry. Oh yeah, we, I remember. We, we shout banged, out Kelly Fastuka. Yeah, but we banged the day. We, it was business with Beatrice's perspective. She Everyone was, knows the story. She was like, we fucked mm -hmm. before we left the house. You didn't need to jerk off again at the hospital. You sick fuck. <laughs> and I was like, well, no, I got horned up again. What do you want me to say? It came up and I wanted to get it out of the way. Yeah, pulled yeah. the venom out. Yeah. You actually. You defanged your snake. That's all I wanted to do. And then Kelly Fasuka, that stupid bitch. <laughs> that things. is She's hilarious. Like, like, wow, you weren't even bothered by the fact that he was jerking off while I you I can't believe that Beatrice. She was wanking his <laughs> dinner. You was having a baby. <laughs> is that bad? Oh, no, 
Rose, I'm not supposed to say that. Oh, I broke Rich. up a family. It literally was the final straw. <laughs> that was it. She could not get over the fact that I would go to the bathroom and jerk off while she was in the I hospital. I don't know. It seems like you're dating an animal. <laughs> you had a baby with him. Um... I get it, though. You got time. It's a lot of time. It's a long day. I was there for 20 hours. <laughs> That's yeah. a lot. It's not a lot of time. It is a long time. <laughs> yeah, I mean, And especially if you look at... If I'm, I'm not like... It's literally just getting the fucking evil out. Like, get this fucking calm out of me, dude. Let me go back to being focused Stop. on being a good dad. It's shooting your gun in the dirt. Yeah. You didn't hurt anybody. <laughs> yeah, dude. At I'm that fine. point, you weren't even a dad. I wanted to go be a good dad as he was coming. Yeah, to you didn't want your your kid coming out and you thinking he's hot. Yeah, you wanted him to con- you wanted to. Dude, con- I wanted zero up. chance of me wanting to bang my own baby. Yeah. So I wanted to get that out, and I that was that. But don't then, you find all the nurses when the baby comes, all the nurses there? You're so vulnerable. I just was in love with all of them. They're was, all like doing when when we crying, did the baby. Like, I want to marry everybody in here. We had a doctor and and this blonde nurse that was with her for the whole night. Yeah, at around three fifteen, uh-huh. the doctor was like. It's happening. Yeah. I need your help. And that blonde nurse. To her or you? To me. And I walked over like, I don't know what to do. And I, yeah. th- I was like, I throw up easy. So I really can't look at this. Yeah. And she's like, nobody's here. And then this old black woman came in and relieved the, uh, the blonde nurse. And she would come in, hello. Hey, baby. She's like this. No, no, no. She this is like, how it's going to go, weirdo. She was, <laughs> I'm going to pull that baby out your, at your wife's stinky ass pussy. Dawn goes like this. She came in, she's like this. Another white devil in the world. She goes, look at this, go. another pink problem <laughs> she for was, my son. She walked in like this. She walked in, she goes. Prometheus. She goes, <laughs> <laughs> she goes, she goes Side. hello, yeah, hello, uh, I will be here. And she was just miserable. Yeah. And Don went. I don't want her. Damn. I want her. To the blonde? To the blonde and to wow. the doctor. She goes, I don't want her. With, I want her. To with, them, it came off as very racist. Yeah. <laughs> Especially with the Massachusetts accent. <laughs> Fuck that. I'm not having a fucking Good. black hand in my fucking, fucking pussy. Three-fifths of a hand is not going to pull out this baby. I think you know which she, side of the bus fiasco I it was It wasn't on. because she was black. I yeah, should, it, was. It, it was because she was fucking miserable. Yeah. She was miserable. She came in with it. She's about to give birth. The baby's coming out. Hello, uh, I'm gonna be. And Don went. I don't want her. I want her. I will say the, that it's very entitled of you to be like, I don't want her. I want her. Like her. She. You know like what? This, like this black lady's got to be excited to deliver your baby. You you whatever, want whatever, you want the fuck good not? fucking energy in the room. She goes. I'm gonna go watch Steve Harvey on Family Feud. <laughs> <laughs> whatever, you white devil, white bitch. So we had two people: the blonde nurse, me, and the doctor. That was it. And no blacks. <laughs> 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 I knew I shouldn't have said that. I don't know. Bobby why I said goes. Blacks. There was a separate drinking fountain for a reason. Yeah, you didn't have don't. to. You didn't have to say blonde or black. You could have just said one nurse. I was trying to yeah. describe. I was trying You're to painting describe. a picture. You painted, I was painting you a painted picture. A real bad. And picture. I did paint a bad picture. <laughs> you painted a real. I really did. Yeah. She yeah. Goes, she would have just been. Oh, so man. I'm just saying, like you had all these people in your. How many how many nurses were helping you? Well, we were there for 24 hours, so they were in and out. But then it was a C-section, so you have, uh, what do you call it, the anesthesiologist, you have the doctor, another doctor, there's a couple nurses. Well, that's and a different takes thing. The baby. Because then people are sewing up the stomach while the other people are taking the baby and all that shit. Yeah, my wife did it the natural way, yeah. the way God meant it to yeah. happen. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. Did, you get, did you get circumcised? Did you get I was going to ask that. I forgot to ask that. Did you ask I'd rather that? not talk about my son's penis. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Because Louis, we're going to have a whole thing. I Lewis has got to get all jacked up about it. I'm not. My son's not circumcised. Yeah, we had this argument before. Did we? I'm yeah. not going to be jacked up. It's just abusing your child. <laughs> it's not an argument. They feel it. There's no reason. We figured out a long time ago that it's actually not a real thing. It's not for them. It's for the girls that have to suck it <laughs> no, later. Dude, no, now 60% <laughs> yeah, of little dude. boys are not being circumcised. In, in the future, in 10 years, by the time your kid's getting his dick sucked... Being circumcised is going to be less common than girls are going to know how to debone that fish. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it was really something beautiful. In order to blow them, you have to put three pieces of scotch tape on it. <laughs> All right, check, check, check. What am I putting together? A tent? <laughs> just a, a pin off a mannequin? <laughs> she goes, oh, okay, that's a good cock. I'm going to suck the shit out of this. Oh, it's man, disgusting. Put it back. She goes, yeah, you're really ready to go, huh, buddy? It's like unrolling a sleeping bag. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Goes, How does this even fit in here? She goes, I'm not going to be able to get it back in the bag. I can try. I can try. Coffee's here. Bring it over. Oh. Don't be scared, Spider. Oh. Bring it over, Spider. Dance it over. Dude, you should not wear holes in your jeans with your wolf no, look at Those are his man. jeans. Fucking asshole. He doesn't have holes. Those are just his jeans. He can't afford regular what jeans. Fuck? Why does he have Double wolf Double cup, hair? but the holes aren't aligned. What the hell is this? Is that me? It also doesn't spill out when I walk. Oh, I see. The holes aren't aligned. That's why you had to get a seat. Thanks, dog. Mm. 
Oh, that's some good. That's some good sweet cream. I made Danny shave his knees. Dan, why don't you have a baby? Come on, buddy. Hey, what am I a jerk off? Can't. Let's do it. Thank well, you, buddy. What? No, he's not having kids. I All right. Is it because one of there's something wrong with one of you? No. <laughs> that's such a fucking wild thing to say. Oh, it'll be fun. If, if, if there was, I wouldn't say it right here. You're a great dad, though. You'd be an amazing dad. I'm gonna be a better uncle. That's gay. Does your do you have a brother or sister? No. She's got a brother that just had a baby. So we go and visit the baby. How old are you? Uncle Danny. 40. How old is she? 36. You're right. Oh, wow. A couple of years you could have one. I don't think we are. I think it will change. You weren't going to have one, too. Didn't you say you weren't going to have one? Yeah, yeah I didn't want one. A couple of years had... ago, you were like, fuck that. We're not yeah. doing it. Well, it was a couple of years ago. It was many years ago. Well, whatever. You said she was too old or something. It was less than two years yeah. ago. Yeah. Well, she still is too old. But Yeah, you said you couldn't come with her. <laughs> remember when you said that? You said you couldn't yeah. get there. The yeah. Remember off air you were saying <laughs> you said you had to think of other stuff. <laughs> well, the problem was, you know, I was uh, I was that? raised in a way that I thought having a child ruins your life, and then I real I came to believe that wasn't true, and now I've switched back again. Yeah. Child- <laughs> <laughs> Joe's the smartest one out of all of us. I did have the moment where I was like, good. I got to go see Killers of the Flower Moon again. I got to get a second assessment, and then I was like, Oh, I can't. Yeah, I can't go to a four and a half hour hour movie anymore. Yeah, that was my last movie. Okay, sweet little B. All right, gents, let's thank sheathunderwear.com. I have them on right now. Let me say that's all I wear. That's all I wear, too. I have them on right now. Boy, look at this. Are you kidding me? It's all I wear, but I'd rather not show mine. They're great. I was hard explaining Max what the front pocket was and how his little junk doesn't fit in it yet. Yeah, yeah. So that was a little weird, yeah. but and uh, and showing him that mine does. Yeah, it's nice. It's fantastic. They're it's very. Nice. I love. I, you know I, what I love? I never feel like I have a bigger dick than when I show my dick to a child. <laughs> I love not my child. I love the uh, elastic. Being a fat, a chubby dude, yeah, I yeah, like yeah. a big, nice. Dude, they have the elastic. dual pouch technology. You put your dick and your balls into the pouch. It makes you look like you're an underwear model. They have different styles, different colors. I mean, moisture red, moisture wicking. He's <laughs> naming the colors. Red, blue. Dude. I love red. I also love the lady gear. I got my wife has some boy shorts, Ooh. some fucking sports bra. Oh, she yeah. loves it. Oh, I didn't know they had that. Go yeah, off, yeah, they queen. got that. Oh, yeah, dude. So for the eleven wear that. female you know, fans like, that we have, I like taking off the lady stuff. Ooh, when I wear it. It's a secret. They have gator necks. They have winter gear. They have a lot of gator stuff. Neck. It's uh, it's like a scarf type. Oh, thing. I, that was I like the ladies that can penis. wear the man gear. Guys, this is an ad read. What are we doing? Podcasting. We're just talking about, it, dude. We talk about sheath underwear like they're part of the vernacular. Like they're part of the culture, Joe. It's oh. not an ad read, Joe. Maybe it's an ad read to you. Yeah. But this is just us real living, yeah, dude. fucking life, dude. Sheathunderwear.com oh. is the website. Go there right now and use the promo code REGS when you check out. R E G R E G Z. It looks like he's about to pull a harmonica out of his jacket. I know. This next song was called I Was Born with a Fat Tone. R E G Z. Yeah, Regs. Make sure you tell jokes over the fucking call to action. You That's what I was trying to do. Let him read the thing. Let him read the thing. Go to Sheath Thunderbird.com, use that promo code REGS, R-E-G-Z, and you're going to get 20% off your order today. Fast shipping, quick delivery. Love these guys. Sheathunderwear.com. Promo I, I code want, REGS. I just want to 20%? Oh, what, fucking what? No. Robert Patton, Iraq veteran. Fought in the war. A real red-blooded American. Fought in the war. That's where he invented it. So you're supporting an Iraq vet. Love it. Love it. Rack them and slack them, baby boy. Sheathunderwear.com. All right, where were we? Yeah, that's a, that's the thing that stops. You just like, which are it's not even now, but in like three years, your life just becomes like watching every child's movie. And not she, really. Yeah, it's yeah. everything. I've watched, I watched the Barbie movie. I cry. I watched too. the Barbie. Those movie movies too. are so sad now. Oh yeah. Oh, they're about really? cancer and shit. Dude, soul. Soul, soul. Soul. Soul was terrible. Tore my heart out of my chest. What's the one with the I saw, carnival? I saw Soul. What's soul the one with up. the make the make uh, make believe uh, adventure park? Remember the one? The, the in the first ten minutes, the mom dies of cancer. Oh, oh. that's up. up. Now. Up has the no. saddest beginning ever. He's, a, but like, he just described the plot and f- everything about Up. An amusement park. I said amusement park. I, it has nothing to do with Up. I said I think amusement you're dumb park. And you think that a house with balloons is an amusement no, park? No, I said you know, when a house floats, <laughs> that's an amusement park. At one, yeah, it's it's you know, called like Wonderland. Flags. I think it's called Wonderland. The folks at home have no idea. This is about to be a fist fight between Lewis and Bobby no, over no, Up. No, no, no. It's Wonderland. Bobby, you look like a young, Wonderland. You look like a, like a young Up guy. Look at there it is right Wonder there. Park? That movie. Wonder, Wonder Park. Park. This, is this a movie, shit movie. Saddest movie ever. Nobody's Wonder seen this movie. Saddest movie ever. Saw this movie. Nobody heard of it. It's a Nobody fun. It, it was a hit. Did you it's make this? Hit. Hit. Dude, if, it was a hit. Make if it's this class. type of movie and it's not by Pixar or Disney, it looks. I mean, it was by Paramount Pictures Paramount? and it was a hit. It wasn't a hit. It was a hit. It was a hit. It was a hit. It stunk. Oh, you stink. Give me, give me the the reviews. Play the trailer. Saddest movie of all time. Dude, make me cry. No, but let's get the reviews first because I bet you that it the was girl, not a hit. I the bet girl, you. I had to this Here's the plot: the girl and her mom and the dad. 
make this little thing in the living room, like a, a, a wonder park in the thing. Sure. The mom dies. Shout out, Jesus. Fucking cancer. Goes away to cancer uh, a place. Never comes home. Cancer place? Yeah, cancer she place. goes away to like a She cancer- goes to a farm upstate. Yeah, like a hospital. <laughs> they, have, they have to tell Bobby that people die the way read you tell the, read, read what it is. Read, read what Dude, it is. she's living in a field. It's better, to be honest. Dude, she loves playing fetch up there all the time. <laughs> 34%. Look at that. Oh, and the audience oh scores my God. God. No, no, no. This thing got rocked. This thing got rocked. This thing got fucking decimated. Yeah, the audience hated it. Oh, my God. I think the God had Look at the spill, Bob. Corn, the people said, "Fuck this oh movie." Oh my god! Because it was go, so sad. I bet go, you read it. It's sad. Go, if you cried at this, you're a <laughs> read, read the fuck you. This wow. was made for dumb people to cry. Seven to. people liked it. Oh shit! Dude. Read, read the v- reviews. The, the tomato meter. What does it say? Wonder Park doesn't come close. To holding doesn't... a candle to the better animated fair of recent years. <laughs> he is calling other movies fair. Which Sanitize, uninspired, and forgettable. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> It's, it's not, not very, very much, much fun. fun. <laughs> oh my god, dude! What could have been a fun movie instead is a joyless. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's sad. Mess. That's what I said. It's sad. That's so. Funny. It's sad. I am tasting. What's the last one? <laughs> oh, the last one's great. Though the film's copious flash and dazzle will please This kids, is a good one. This is a good one. <laughs> there's an awful lot of subtext going on here about facing your fear. Okay, that's nice. This is coupled with some pretty nightmarish imagery involving the zombie chimps. Can you even say that? That's what he called the, that's <laughs> what he called the nurse. <laughs> fucking, he goes, sorry, I don't want to <laughs> No chimp. zombie chimps in the fucking delivery goes, room. Can we she cut goes, that, please? <laughs> she goes, baby, I don't want to deal with your shit either. Oh, uh, take this film. Excuse me, zombie chimp. Get out of the room, zombie I, chimp. I, I want the blonde. <laughs> One. <laughs> I want the blonde one. She's better. <laughs> the blonde lady was Puerto Rican. <laughs> she goes, uh, I'm die blonde, stupid. <laughs> That's hilarious. Well, oh, maybe it. it wasn't as good as <laughs> the I animal love characters. I, the I, animal characters that roam the park are sadly uninspired. <laughs> and there's only a small hint of magic created throughout. Damn. <laughs> Damn. This is a whole <laughs> cartoon about that, cancer. Can I say something? Max didn't like it either. He hated it. <laughs> he didn't like it. He actually covered I was crying and he covered my eyes. He's like, Dad. Chill. Stop crying. Oh my God. Yeah, maybe I'm maybe. Can we see the could, trailer? Can we please see the trailer? Yeah, watch please. the trailer. Max goes, I didn't know I had two moms. Oh. Huh. That was give me the bond damage. Don didn't want to go. I, I, the whole grief. Yeah, like, we we've just seen it. Like every, first of all, like since the beginning of time, Bambi, fucking the mom dies, right? Fucking uh, the the good dinosaur, the dad dies. I oh, mean, yeah. uh, good dinosaur. That great. was a great. That's the movie. first movie that James saw in the movie theater. That that was Max's first movie. That was a great movie. Kiss. That, that and uh, as a dad, you just watch the dad die. Like, no, come back. <laughs> yeah. Please. Did you cry? Did you cry? I held it in. I cried. Oh. It. So did Soul. I cried throughout the Soul whole a, movie, dude. Soul was a tear. The whole movie Soul's just nuts, dude. It's so Soul's good. Soul's bad. It makes you like literally like, am I doing the right thing in life? Like, what is <laughs> you? You look in the mirror differently after you watch Soul. Yeah, yeah. I had one of those cries where you really you look down at your feet and think. Yeah. Let's you see. watched a kids movie as an adult by yourself? Yeah. Mm. Good. It's a Pixar movie. Pixar movies rock. Yeah, they're great. Good. Here we go. All right. Wonder and Park. We're gonna pray. To open the park. Okay. It's That's the trailer? To open the park. Yeah, we got that. The trailer sucks too. <laughs> now open. I like it when the ideas come from you. I have to say the animation's better than mom. I expected. And it opens up so fun. Oh, she gets pussy cancer too. But eventually we all grow up. Oh uh, look. Damn. Mom's dead. This March. This March. A movie so retarded. Bobby <laughs> cried. Do, do the Pablo Francisco. Oh, that's the zombie chimp. This. The nurse that Bobby wouldn't let deliver his. <laughs> a roller coaster. In a world where zombie chimps are not allowed to deliver babies, a movie so stupid it made Bobby cry. How is this possible? Hello, my name is Steve. I know who you are. You know who we are. Look at Bobby mouthing the words from the movie. He loves it, dude. <laughs> fucking Steve, dude. Steve, dude. Steve shows up. The best it's character fucking, ever. I'm telling you right now, honestly, I heard they wanted Daniel Day Lewis to voice him, but he said he couldn't live as a hedgehog for six fucking months. <laughs> Of chimpanzees, so cute but so <laughs> naughty. 
I mean, it's literally they were like, dude, what could be cute? Ch chimpan zombies. What is the, what is the plot of this? Fucking I know movie, they don't even Bobby? mention the plot. There's nothing happening here, dude. She's bringing the park that she made with her mom in the living room. When the mom died, she took it all down, but now it came to life, and she's she's making it. Come it's like back. Indian in the cupboard, guys. Hold up, I think I can get Indian in the cupboard ruled. Indian in the cupboard ruled, dude. Bobby, I think I got a movie you're gonna love. What? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we got him. <laughs> He's I mean, it literally is just like a bunch of flashes of different like, types of animals. There's no plot. Someone at Paramount goes, it's not even a real movie. Wait, where are the zombie chimps? I don't yeah, get it. They're coming. They're all around. Someone has his own We'll be podcast. playing in theaters from March 15th to March 21st. <laughs> it ran for four days. Hey, just keep this ad playing in our ear if you could do that. I was just thinking it'd be good if we just had an advertisement playing in our fucking ear during the. I mean, dude, Joe you know, has gotten so spicy. He's like, ornery since fatherhood. Yeah. Well, I got you know lack of sleep, and you got to discipline these children. It's true. From yeah, early. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see these baby photos now. Might all be a good time. Right, the baby we're gonna photos. do a thing now. Let's do where plugs. Let's do we're, plugs. We're gonna, the baby photos. We'll go. We're gonna bring the baby. We'll bring the baby photos out. We'll do plugs. But we got all these baby photos of Dan, Joe, me, and Lewis, and we're gonna decide who's the cutest. Are we gonna do plugs first? We're gonna yeah. do plugs first. Plug it up. Yeah, plug it up. Go, Dan. Uh, when does this come out? Tuesday. Tuesday. This Tuesday. So yeah. I will be this Tuesday. Uh, this in Friday. a world where in Dan world. has gigs this weekend, this, not as good as Nate's. This never is not good sold as out yet. No, not even close. <laughs> San Antonio. One of the shows has a low ticket warning. <laughs> Very low. <laughs> Should have stayed on the oh, bonfire. Oh no, a low ticket <laughs> bar. <laughs> uh, Friday and Saturday, I'll be at LOL in San Antonio, and then I will be at Portland Helium. San Francisco, I'll be at Cobbs. This is all in the next two weeks. And then I will be um, at the Royal Oak Theater in Royal Oak, Michigan. Ooh, the nice. Buckhead Theater in Ooh. Atlanta. Paramount Theater in Philadelphia. Ooh. And then we added a late show to Red Bank Vogel. DanSoder.com for all Ooh. of them. Yeah. And then my, uh, my new podcast, Soder, will be coming out in uh, two weeks. What? This is my last name. I couldn't. I didn't want Soder. to come up with a name. Wow. Sorry to You're leaving Soder. us again. Fucked up. Damn, dude. Wow. Mm. Joe, what do you got besides a new baby? Uh, DC Improv, November 17th Ooh. and 18th. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah. November 17th Whatever. and 18th. That's and then uh, <clears throat> that's my last uh, weekend of the year. And then uh, Tacoma, January 11th through the 13th. And then Poughkeepsie the weekend after that. Pittsburgh Improv, March 28th through the 30th. And go to punchuplive.com, right? Punch Bob, up you're on there. Punchuplive.com. The, I, yeah. I don't have anything yet, but I love those. I'm guys. telling you. Punchuplive.com. This is the future. Punchup.live.com. You, you get the data of your fans, and you know where the fuck they are, yep. so you know where you can Joe's sell. And it's also completely un unbelievable. That's good. It's but also uncensored. Joe's completely, uncensored. Uncensored. <laughs> completely uncensored. It will not get struck down for monetization. You cannot. You put it up there. You can charge for stuff. You can give it for free. I'm putting stuff out at the beginning of the year. Punchup.live is the next thing for comics. If you don't get on it now, you're a fucking idiot. I'm going to be putting some stuff up there. Yeah. The, the future, a website. Well, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> you, get, you actually get the data, which is great, unlike YouTube. What do you mean? You get all the data from YouTube. No, you don't. You don't get emails. You get no emails. Oh, okay. You get all the e I, I got thousands of emails from putting my special up there. I wish okay. I put it up there before I... So, uh, I got a lot of live stuff coming up. Um, I'm not touring until the new year, but a brand new tour, the Meaty Ogre Tour, happening uh, in a city near you. Uh, uh, already up on the website, Emias, Pennsylvania, Saratoga Springs, Tampa... Des Moines, Red Bank, New Jersey, Royersford, Pennsylvania, St. Louis, American Comedy Company, San Diego, and then more. There's like 10 or, or 12 more cities confirmed. They're all going up on the website. So grab tickets at lewisofskanks.com. Check out my other pods, Legion of Skanks and Real Ass Podcasts, all available on the Gas Digital Network. And, um, yeah, make sure you guys fucking suck and fuck. But the show's not over right now. No, no I got my plugs. A little fucking um, plug. We got another half hour left. Go to punchup.live, watch my special for free. Killbox is up there. I actually just put a, a bunch of other things up there. We're going to be uh, putting a lot of uncensored clips, comedy clips, stuff I can't put on Instagram or Twitter or whatever the fuck it is, uh, TikTok, because they'll take it down and fuck me. It's going up on punchup.live. So go there, check out my special, check out all my other stuff, and uh, also go to robertkellylive.com. Can you pull the thing up for me, you fucking asshole, Max? <sighs> Check out my special too. Half hour special on my YouTube channel. I think uh, we need a fifth intern. These four suck. I mean, can you pull the fucking thing up? RobertKellyLive.com, you fucking turd. <laughs> I mean, what are you, mentally ill? Uh, I'm going to be uh, 
Potsdam, PA. Oh, God. Go back up. <laughs> I fucking hate this kid. <laughs> the 11th. Ooh. I'm going to be at Soul Joe's. I'm going to be at uh, Baltimore, the port, for a weekend. Brand new club I'm working. Improv uh, Comedy Theater in uh, Diana by Beach, Florida. I don't know. Donya. Donya. Thank you, Lewis. Donya Beach. That club's very fun. I heard it was great. Comedy Works, Saratoga in January. I'm going to be at the uh, Bub's Pub uh, in uh, Germantown, Wisconsin. Glendale, all over the place. I'm going back to Comedy Connection on the uh, 26th of January. One of my favorite clubs in the world, Uncle Vinny. Side Splitters. I'm doing a whole West Coast Florida run in March, June, and I just booked McCurdy's in between there. So uh, Wait, we're check, plugging 2024. Check it. No, no, no. It's 2023. I plugged 2024. I mean 2024. Yes, it is early. Uh, so there you go. I was just doing 2023. Uh, nice talking to you. you. You're just doing theaters. I'm doing clubs. I only have one date because I have a child. I'll be I'm not doing theaters for long. Well, theaters are crazy because if you don't sell it out, you don't make it. There's money. such a big cost on the theater. Yeah. When a club. I'm doing it, smaller theaters. Buckhead's not that big in uh, Paramount. You'll, sell, you'll big. sell it out. You'll sell it. People love it. I want you, I want you to say you fucking, you're kicking ass. Thanks. You're Come killing on. it, dude. You're doing theaters. Wait, you're doing put, clubs, you, pull your shoulders back a little. You're doing theaters. Don't yeah. try to, don't how's try your, to do how's that. How's your podcast doing? We've always I'm done sorry. that. I mean, I've, we're doing an episode. You're doing an episode next week. I'm gonna have these Am I on next week? I'm knuckleheads. Yeah, you're coming in on Wednesday to record. We already have it down in the calendar. Oh, yeah. Where do you record? My apartment. So I'm going to have both of you guys. Nice. You I can't a baby. wait. Lewis, after he fights, where he's allowed to smoke weed. and I can smoke weed. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do now, we're going to see who has the cutest baby photo. And I think I'm. I think it pretty much goes without saying I'm going to be numero Dude, uno. Kidding me? I got no, I say lock. cutest. I mean, oh, here, okay, here's Dan's baby. Dan's is unreal. I mean, dude, cute as in what? As in adorable? I don't know. Dude. I'll say this. Cheap. The photographer sucks. I mean, this is like out of focus. It's I can see how good it is. 83. I mean, dude, is that's his, not 83, his you outfit asshole. stinks. Yeah, that's like 85. You're like look, two you years old, Dan. Dan, I don't know what it is, dude. It just looks like this isn't you. It just looks like a like like an old man. It looks like an old man. You yeah, look like an old I go, man. I don't. I don't yeah. want them <laughs> touching me. Yeah, I want the blonde nurse. Give you're, me my binky. Yeah, yeah, your mouth looks like it makes moonshine. I think the red thing's a wheelchair. Yeah, I got. You know what's funny is I lost my legs in Korea. <laughs> yeah, but I don't like one eye is kind of off. Dog, I've always been wonked, and you know that. <laughs> no. You're adorable. This is adorable. Hey, fuck you, Joe. That is not adorable. That's an adorable baby. You yeah, are. if you're, it's an adorable old man. It's an adorable. Every good baby looks like you. You do have sure. Lewis's hairline, which is a little off. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> Jesus uh, Christ! Are you okay? this, whenever this thing is, what was like, that? It's, it's great. What First was of all, that? that's not natural. They positioned you like this. You're not even smiling. You're farting. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, Wait, guys. This is me totally <laughs> chilled out. <laughs> it's a good headshot. <laughs> you do. I don't like your, your fucking giant ears. Yeah, dude. <laughs> look at the size God, of those look ears. Look at a little dude. sweetie pie. I like the collar. Thanks, dude. Popped. <laughs> it's nice. Uh, I think you look great. Yeah, Everyone else is going to try to shit on everyone. No. I, they're even going to try no, to no. say my photo's bad. <laughs> you, uh, you're just trying, you know what's coming for your look, photo. Look, yeah, you got you a know. button nose. You got big cheeks. It's not a button nose. It's a fucking... Your little, nose has changed. Your nose baby. was better then. He's got a button <laughs> nose. He's got a zipper head. Yeah. His tongue's too big for his mouth. <laughs> <I'm> all, <laughs> his uh, mouth is open because his yeah, tongue's this, fat. There you go. Mrs. Soder, your son has fat tongue. <laughs> We're going to have to cut some of it off. For sure we can't say zipper head. What? Is the zipper head? Is that a racist uh, thing? Yeah. Uh, the Asians? Yeah. Well, it's gonna it's getting bleeped. Out. We're bleeping half. We're not this bleeping episode. zipper head, dude. I mean a retard, dude. I'm I'm reclaiming zipper head for retarded people, dude. Okay. <laughs> Let's go to the next baby. He's playing. Right, wait, wait, wait. He's, he's playing the buckhead. We... I was gonna call him a buckhead before. <laughs> he's playing in the buckhead with... theater. Are we <laughs> done? <laughs> you fucking buckhead. <laughs> fucking buckhead over here. All right. Let's go to the next one. I'm having a great time. There's I mean, Max. There's Max. Max is hanging I mean, out. come on, dude. Look at that body. Dude, yeah. I want to suck in, on Bobby's baby toes. Bobby's <laughs> stuck in a Max photo. <laughs> dude, look at those toes. Look at those also, toes. Dude. That's what, not Max. That's what they, he put in a filter to try to make it that's seem what like he did, man. Did that's they just bring me. you to a diner and take a picture in the booth? Dude, I'm fucking a... Fuck you, dude. I'm adorable. Look at that. Bobby no, was two years away from being addicted to meth in that photo. <laughs> you know, it's funny. Is I was sober for three weeks when they that took was, this right picture. When I, that's right when I got molested for the first time. <laughs> yeah. Dude, those eyes are almost touching. I look mean, how close they are. Look how, you are cute. You do look a lot like Max. I'm cute as fuck. Look at that torso, dude. That dude. torso's, I mean, it's nuts. It's hot. Very I just want to kiss your cum gut. And long hair, too. Look at those long locks. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. But honestly. This is a tough decision between Bobby and, uh, and Dan. 100% not. 
Oh, I'm adorable. I don't know what you are. It's tough. Oh, Bobby just spit <laughs> coming you're everywhere. You're not a fucking adorable. I would throw that other baby out. Are you kidding me? Why? If it was Sparta, just wait, just wait till this episode. If it was drops. Sparta, that baby would get tossed over the hill. Wait till this. Wait till this episode drops and everyone sees how adorable Dude, I am versus your whatever I, the look fuck. At, this look at my is. smile. I have a why, right, you, why is your left foot on your right leg? Because I'm chilling, dude. I'm chilling. I'm, no, hold, I'm holding Joe, my cock up. Joe got what Very I was funny. By the way, look at his left bicep. Yeah. My nice. God, dude. Fucking, fucking Why is your right arm all weak? Look at that fucking No, that's your, that's your right arm. Yeah. Hey, there Jack, dude. No, fucking that looks nice. Oh. That's really beautiful. It's actually making me sad. Knowing what you will go through. <laughs> yeah, that body <laughs> has no this. idea what's coming. Well, when I see this, uh, when I see this little adorable baby, I go, I understand why somebody made him suck a dick for a steak. Yeah. Like, if I had a steak and I saw that mouse, look at that. There's no other solution. So why is that, why is no that baby wearing for that? But Jesus Christ! Why is your baby? Why are you wearing lip gloss? That's not. That's fucking my lips. And you know I have good lips. You do have great. So don't don't He's question those. Well, you went after my cute, adorable, fat cheeks. Yeah, you had, like a, fat, you had a big tongue, dude. Yeah, <laughs> it's hard to imagine Bobby not taking the crown. But we haven't seen Lewis yet. Okay, let's and go I to got Lewis. a little something hidden up my sleeve. Let's too. go to Lewis. Let's go to Lewis. <laughs> That's, that's not, not me. Lewis. That's not me that's at all. Girl. You girl. That's a shit. Puerto Rican girl. A Puerto Rican little gringueta. Yeah. <laughs> gringueta. Gringueta. I'm speaking Spanish. Where's your Where's your baby photo? You didn't, give, you, pollo didn't, de you didn't give us a baby. I photo. did give it. No, a baby it's photo. in the text thread. I, I gave it the text thread, but our. All right, we got it. Here we go. This is my sister. She posted this. It's that, so James is on the right. I'm on the left. So she wanted to just show that. I mean, I'm listen. not gonna lie, Lewis. That little Superman curl. That's got me. It's fucking cute, dude. God oh, damn it. God. I mean, I'm being. Uh, my, I'm, I'm crying because my mom's passed out with a needle in her arm right now. <laughs> yeah. Top left. The though. top one is he's being thrown from the father to the mother. Take this fucking thing. Top left. You are an adorable. <laughs> and the dude. handle is poor and violent. So that's. It's poor Violet. Oh, I see. <laughs> wow. <laughs> it's my sister's. That's my sister's post. I on see. Her Instagram. I tell you, Lewis, you're a little. You're. I mean. You're a little cutie patootie. Yeah. Can you move your huge head? Stop you're it. you're you're very cute, but third place for sure. I'm just gonna be straight third with you. Third place. Are you yeah. looking at the Why is he girl, you, you, you were yeah. angry as a you were angry as a baby? See, my mother was a junkie. My father was a pimp. I understand. I'm not saying you had the easiest life or you have the third Bobby best. Bobby used to be whatever. really fat. He was a giant blimp. I'm doing poems now. I love it, dude. Keep going. <laughs> By the way, Lewis. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> no, it's nice. Speak, it, you're very cute. You're very attractive now. Great lips, obviously. Yeah, good eyes. But that, that fucking Superman lips, curl is. You got good. lips, hips, and yeah. enough for the needy. But you the know Superman what I mean? curl, it's like a prop comic. It didn't rhyme. It's something you got a thing that's nice. No, 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 no. no. I had curly, curly hair, and that was naturally it fell that way. That is nuts, dude. That Superman lips, curl, bad lips, and sexy tits. Yeah, no, it's nice, but Shut. I mean, you could have rhymed. I mean, look at the pain in the little, the face on the bottom left. Look at the pain. Look at the pain on the right. Why was James? Because you're telling me what? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I love if that. this is a pain, he did what in the hospital while I was I being need, born? I need. Need a booby. <laughs> if it's a pain contest, you know, sure. But this is I, a I don't know. Contest. I'm going to say James was a cute little boy. Though. Look how cute. Oh my god, it's spectacular, handsome little, handsome little monkey. He's hungry. Oh. You were a handsome little kid we too. We can't say monkey. Can we bleep that, please? Boop. Hans handsome, I mean, little, handsome, little, handsome little zombie. You look monkey. like a little black baby. Zombie chip. You were really. My father was fucking straight up Afro Latino. He looked like yeah. a fucking African. Yeah, you were definitely. Darker as a kid. I can't wait till they come after me for saying the N word. I'm just gonna just post a picture of my black dad. <laughs> He's okay with it. My black dad says it's okay. All right, it's time to bring out your headliner, everybody. Let's go. Good openers. Yeah, We're guys, all warmed up. The baby you've been waiting for. We're all warmed up. Joe List. Yeah, the lay it on him. Oh, oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Jesus. Booyah. <laughs> Holy what shit! The? What an angry truck were you, driver! Were you looking in a mirror? What's up with that face? Yeah. How did you? Were have, you born during the Great Depression? How did you have herpes <laughs> already on the fold of your right arm? <laughs> Look at my hair! It looks like I have a yarmulke on the top of my head. You got a buzz cut? Would you just come back from Iraq? Oh my god! Those Look nostrils. At, Look at those. I got a, I got I got zombie chimp. Yeah, I mean, my God, dude, that mouth was the same size though. Yeah, you didn't have teeth. It's crazy, and, your mouth never. You didn't grew. have teeth, and they were fucked up then. Yeah. Joe, you're the ugliest baby I've ever laid my eyes on. I'm not it's like the it. opposite of the Gerber baby. <laughs> yeah, it should have been a fucking contest for you. You should fucking. How are you? I've never seen a baby with a man's face immediately. <laughs> Wait, can we pan out a little? Because I have like compression socks on that I thought. Do you really? Like. Yeah. <laughs> so he pans. The pan out means oh, maybe I cut him out. That's I know. What, that, but I my know. pan out means I, get closer to his face. You can hit them if they want. I, no, I meant care. further away. I used no, to. No, I, I used to stick up oh. with Max. Yeah, Lewis was. <laughs> I thought I sent the whole thing. I got some fun socks. Oh on. God, your fucking your mouth is disturbing. Why does it look like you have gel in your hair? 
He looked like it looked like he like he'd be like the the spokes baby for a coal mine. Yeah. <laughs> they go, check if your baby has black lung. Does what? he have these symptoms? I'm sorry, I wasn't it born right with privilege like you, Lewis. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Lewis Look at those big full eyes, though. Full. <laughs> also, you got a you got a fucking black guy's nose. How thick is that nose? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Holy shit, yeah, dude. Lejo. <laughs> and have, yeah, and you, you have shark eyes. I don't know if black. I don't have pesty eyebrows getting in the way. <laughs> yeah, for real. You look like the Terminator after he got thrown out of the car and didn't have <laughs> eyebrows anymore. Yeah. No, I think yeah, I'm That outfit one. is fucking atrocious, too. On your mom. <laughs> That's, that's my sister. That's like an eight-year-old girl. Uh, fuck yeah, yeah. Do you think old. that was a woman behind him? <laughs> is that, is that a, that's a child? That's his sister. Oh, boy. Yeah, I think I take it. Honestly, you take it. Yeah, you take it. If it was the uh, ugliest baby, I do have like boots. I mean, head. I think it goes. Oh, oh, there oh there's us the compression socks, baby. Look at that, dude. How are your legs skinnier than your arms? Oh, why does it take so long to make it bigger? That's what Dawn said. <laughs> That was good. She know. knows why. Lewis, that was good. Oh, yeah, dog. That was good stuff. Just, Those I, boots, they look like uh, like a wrestler boot. Compliments. It was good yeah, stuff. Yeah, fuck you, Dan. It was good. All right, you pep talking asshole. It was good we stuff. We all laughed. We got it. Good stuff. Shut up. <laughs> hey, I hope your podcast fails. Hey. All right, here's what I here's what I say we do. This is what I think. Hey, I got an idea. <laughs> we need piece four pieces of paper and pen. Then we right, rank well, them we'll cutest to ugliest. Episode. Then we add them up, lowest score wins. So you rank Bobby one, Soder two, Lewis three, Joe four. It's everyone's is going to be in that order. We all add them up individually, secret ballot. They count them up. Lowest to highest, highest score is the worst. All right. Look. I mean, you Just lost. Lowest score is the best. Yeah, you, you lost. Joe, we'll see. Joe, can't, can't, we can't, can't, can't one more time. Only one of we'll about see. Joe, can you please Kelly explain how it works just one more time in detail? Me. Well, you have a low IQ, <laughs> and you're all looking at me like I'm retarded. Can we get some pens and paper? Joe, you lost. We'll see. No, we know. No, 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 We're we looking know. at your face. Genuinely, it's. I'm just wondering if I'm going to beat Bobby in this. You're not. You can't. Your body was uh, atrocious. My body's a wonderland. Your Bobby is a wonderland. <laughs> There's no way you, you beat my my baby body? We're not going on bodies, dude. We're going on sweet. You're going on everything. everything. And it's head to toe. I, I, head to toe, I, dude. I judge, I judge yeah. the body as one score, yeah. the face is another score, and then I combine the personality so what are we, is what are we doing? What are we doing? Rank. First, one, two, three, four. Oh, I guess I'll use my boogers. To write on this. Wow. I got a little flack there. Danny I got you. 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 So hold on. One, one was Dan. No, then, don't say it. Don't no, say no, no. One was Dan. I mean, in the order. Yes. Oh, that's Dan. Then, number one then, is the cutest. Then, then me. Dan, then you. Joe. There's mine. Lewis. Bobby. And then I write the. Don't say it. But I write, the, I, I write the number next to him in order. Yeah. The number next. The lowest score wins. Yeah, I got it. Well, it doesn't sound like you got it. Fuckhead. I didn't get it. What are you doing? I didn't get it. I'm turning it in. All right, here. It's officially who the cutest baby is. Oh. Okay. Here we go. It also doesn't have to be a secret ballad. No. Yeah, I know. It doesn't have to. We don't have to do this. Yeah. Well, we can reveal later, we could, but it's, we could stay home and not talk. <laughs> All right, so. <laughs> that's be We're trying to be silly and have fun. Yeah, okay, we're trying to have a good time over here, okay? You okay, bip? <laughs> you okay, bip? All right. I like you, Dennis Miller. Are you ready? It's half half Miller, half Clifton. I mean, it's going to take him 45 minutes to add these fucking No, he's autistic. It's going to take him five seconds. Yeah, he just has to look at the paper and don't remember. Yeah, he knows right now. Now, getting the paper is difficult. What's that? Uh, some of you misunderstood the instructions. Uh, really? I'll, I'll hit How you. How do you know? I will hit you in your Why, face. Why, did someone put me as number one? <laughs> so, I will uh, hit you right in your you face if you ever said who no. did, Who messed up? Well, I don't know who's is who. Well, you know who's this. So what is, what is the issue? But people just rated one, two, three, four in order instead of giving them a one, two, four rank. No, that, that's, no that's the fuck. Oh. He's, yes, that's the order. Max, take over. <laughs> so, someone fucked up. Oh. So well, someone doesn't have up? numbers next to theirs? If it says one, that's the no, number one. If there's no numbers, that's the order of the cuteness, my assumption is. I put the name and then I put the number in terms of one through four of what I thought. I did the yeah. same thing. Dan, did you not do that? What'd you put one through four in the babies. Everybody has numbers next to it, right? Yeah. Yes. Can I look. Let me look. <sighs> you can't look. You're supposed to be. Joe has a nice ass. It's the same thing. You fuck. It. Oh. I can't. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry, guys. Okay. I mean, Natalie's right there. She Natalie, take, Natalie's she, so good. She could take over at any point. She's, she's really just yeah. sitting there. 
Take over, Natalie. No, Natalie's the best. Say something. She recorded my podcast, and I went, can you edit this, please? Can and you then please she just didn't edit it. Help them. Wow. Said I thought I was joking. Wow. <laughs> Fucked me. Wait, really? What did she, what, yes. did, what did you edit? What did uh, she leave in? Hold on. I just, I'd rather not say. I just spit all <laughs> Natalie, what did you leave I in? I love Lewis goes, I love Joe goes, can you edit this? And was, she goes, yeah. Right. I was like, cut all of that. And she's like, I thought you were kidding. Respectfully, you've said to cut like four things in this episode. Well, I'm kidding. This episode. This <laughs> that's is a good point. Uh, I'll, like give that. Benefit, I'll give Natalie the benefit when I'm of the doubt. joking when I'm not. I say edit like 20 times an episode. So if I'm ever serious, at the end of the episode, I go, I'm serious about that edit because yeah. I, that's a joke that we all make. My bad. So. Apology accept. I mean, apology given. I'm, I'm also sorry. Oh, right. God. Oh. I love her. She, it, she apologizes Natalie's, for nothing. She's great. She's great. Doesn't it feel like we had a connection? There? I, I, they fuck up and they laugh at me. Yeah. Uh, Max, you're an idiot. See? <laughs> it's fucking great. nuts. That I mean, this is taking a long time. The most someone can have is 16. This, the least someone can have is it's four. Natalie, it's crazy that it's Natalie, eight. please take over. Now go in reverse order. Do we have it? Who's the loser? Go fourth yeah, place no. to third place to second place Who, to first You want place. the loser? No, we want yeah. the loser. No. Okay. Good. Good. Who's the loser? So the, last, uh, the most points, Joe has 16 points. So 100% of people voted me fourth. Yeah, you're the ugliest baby we've ever seen. Yeah, yeah look at that. Yeah, you, I mean, you even voted yourself fourth. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you put yourself fourth. I mean, babies I just are it. inherently cute. Like, I love the smells of babies. Baby, you look you look like you smell like shit, Joe. That baby looks like it would smell so uh, bad. Fuck no, it. I look like I fucking got back from the war and got a job carrying boxes. Yes. Yeah, that's exactly right. Oh, that outfit sucks, too. All right. Go ahead. Third place is Dan. With Fuck nine. you guys. Seriously? You? Dan, uh, you're not. You're how many an old points man. did he have? Nine Suck my dick. Nine, nine points. points. Suck my fucking dick. That's sick. shocking. Why is it shocking? Bring Dan back up. It's adorable. Dude. I would. I, I actually wanted to pick Joe before Dan. You're That's out of crazy. Your, I nah. cannot believe. You're out of your fucking You beat Lewis. Kids. All right. Second place got to be Lewis. I mean, Dan, Dan has a... Dan's trying too hard in that photo. Yeah, Dan, they they, they propped you up in a yeah, cute way, it's but fake. it's actually not cute. Yeah, and I bet they did some weird shit. Yeah. To not make you, cute, Dan. I yeah, they're you, full of shit. It's you not think cute. you guys are fucking That's a phony photo. They made that Thank happen. Thank you, Joe. Yeah. They made that happen. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. I put you a second, but not. This is before. This is the equivalent of like a girl using a, a fucking filter on her face. They right. made you cuter than you really yeah, are. Nobody, no baby can do this. You don't know that? I'm a thinker. And your little fist, like you're holding a pen, like Bob Dole. I don't like it. Bob Dole. <laughs> Bob Dole. All right, who's second place? Second place is Lewis. Fuck off. Yeah, Bobby again. Now I want to know lips. The, I want to know the score. And I though. won fucking. I'm the sexiest baby. What was my score? Points. How many? Eight. And oh. what did Bobby get? Six. Wow. Now who didn't put Bobby number one? You two didn't put Bobby number one. No, because Bobby's not. The I put baby. me number one. Well, I you, put me number one. I'm sorry. Let me ask you a question. What did you say? I said you're not the cutest baby. You're an asshole. It feels like I'm you're the only one that actually spiteful, answered. You're a spiteful honestly. asshole. You're not spiteful at all. No, you didn't think Lewis was sexy. I think Lewis is cute as hell. My his baby picture is cuter than my baby picture. Angry little. I just I don't like Cyclops babies, and your eyes are too close together. So I like Lewis is better. His little Superman. Curls yeah. Well, your ears are big. Yeah, I know because yeah. I can hear. Yeah, your mouth, your tongue is too big. He listens like a good friend. I like that you take everything I say and make it into a positive. Yeah. Your tongue's too big. Voices. How can I do all those accents? <laughs> yeah, your nose is weird. Dad, I'll give you. <laughs> yeah, your nose changed the most. Yeah. Yeah, yeah your nose thing. went you, through it a, was a, It was like a little push-up button nose. And like somebody said, let me fix that fucking thing. It was my mom down. going like this. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck yeah. up. Now it's a Roman fucking soldier mask. Now it's got not too much. Yeah. Smushed. <laughs> Yeah, it's awful. Everyone, uh, write in the comments. Get the I, algo going. Put you, rank them in the comments. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I, li I think you're cute, baby Dan. But they made you that. That's not real. I was born this way. Now you weren't. I was born into it. I was molded by the cute. All right. I'll well, another I got a cute face. ass photo. What do I get? Nothing. What? What do you think? It was a contest? Yeah, he got molested. That's what happened. Because <laughs> I was so cute. Yeah, that was yeah. a prize. Nobody touched you. <laughs> no. Well, to put me in that pose, they did. They abused me to fucking crook my arm, my little fucking boneless arm. Let's try to make our poses. Dude, I'll do that, right? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, let me Hang on, let me, let me get a, let me get a oh. photo. Let me get a photo. Can well, we, all, we got to all go, all go in that photo. Hold on. In that seat. It's left it. arm, left. so let me go. Okay, Lewis, you're going to go upside down, don't you? Do the little hair curl. Why? It's funny to be an asshole. Which one are you doing? Upper bottom. That's a good one. 
right, Joe. Here we go. Take, take your hat off. <laughs> Dude, I'm allergic to uninteresting bits. Oh, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> this is great. Look at me. It just looks hard. Look, over the, look up and away and angry. Make your mouth. A little That's angry. it. I got it. <laughs> Dude, oh, you're supposed to hold your arm like this. Yeah, Bobby, I'll do you. Get your shirt off. Yeah, get in your underwear. Yeah, shirt off, dude. Get your undies, dude. <laughs> he looks so much like Max. It's crazy. It I know. Crazy. Ears are a little big. No, the other way. Your body's gonna be the other. Yeah. There you go. Oh man, that's pretty good. Get your your right arm, your but right no hand teeth. out a little more. No teeth. Lips together. No teeth. Lips together. Right hand out a little more. Open. Right hand out. Get put your right the other hand. Yeah. Like this. Yeah. 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 That's pretty good. Yeah, that's Dan, really get out of the picture. Beautiful. Yeah, that's we fun. were all cute babies. What's your earliest memory? Earliest memory. Who boy. Um I don't know. God, I don't all right. Good talk, boys. Uh <laughs> oh, there you think. go. Nice episode. What's your earliest memory, Bob? My earliest memory memory was my being passed to my great grandmother. I remember my mom was holding me in my grandmother's living room where we lived, and she handed me to this old lady. It scared the shit out of you. I auditioned, but never. That was got a passed. weird thing that I remember. That yeah, I remember the desk. I remember that those my grandmother's those. You know, back in the day, they used to have a writing desk that yeah. you she would do the bills at, and it would fold out in the hallway. It was weird. I remember that. Yeah, it was weird. I started crying. I remember that. What was your first memory? Uh, I think watching Goonies with my father in a hotel. Okay. Or or we had a dog named Dookie. Yeah. Who, that this dog, this dog was named Dookie specifically because he shit all over the house. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> such a Puerto Rican way to name a dog. Yeah. It's like, Mira, what are you doing? <laughs> Mira, what are you doing? He pooping. He Dookie, man. He Dookie, man. He man, dookie. name him Dookie. But it's like, it's such a thing like we wouldn't have named the dog until we knew that personality yeah. trait of him. That is, um, that's like Native Americans. They they name the dog of what happens. Yeah, so the, I, I remember just being on like, <laughs> I had one of those... Um, it was like one of those horses that had like four springs. Yeah. So you like almost like bounce on it like yeah. a shitty like a shitty toy, you know? Yeah, yeah. But I remember being on this horse with my sister and not being able to get off because there was so much dog shit all over the floor in the house. So it's funny. Like, the floor wasn't oh, lava, God. the floor was shit. <laughs> the floor was shit. <laughs> 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 we used to play the floor. The floor is shit. <laughs> Mira, don't touch the floor, it's shit. <laughs> you gotta get from the couch to the yard. Uh, you're gonna <laughs> jump over to the counter or you're gonna talk shit. Yo, go get me the cereal. Yo, don't step oh. in the shit. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Jai Jai. The floor is shit. <laughs> Jai Jai. <laughs> Jai 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 Jai. Puerto Rican, the floor is love. The floor is shit. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, what about you? I don't know. It's hard to say. I, uh, I don't know. I have memories. No specific early. What is a memory? memory. I mean, memory. I remember. I do remember being. Uh, I mean, maybe I, I guess I remember things before that. I remember moving into my house that my parents live in. And, that was 86. I was four. I remember watching the, like, the intro to the NBA final, Celtics and Lakers, and then being like Kareem coming out. We were all booing. and it was That's fun. fun. I remember that. Yeah. That was That's fun. very fun. But I think I probably have memories earlier than that, but not like distinct memories. Yeah. What was uh, your first worst memory? First worst memory. Dookie, the horse. Um, <laughs> For me? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'll, I'll go. The floor his, shit. Do you guys not want me to go? His first, oh, sorry, go ahead. The go floor ahead. shit. Uh, I, was, I was joking with Lewis. The way Lewis answered, he goes, Can I go? I'll go first. Dude, his, with his, the horse. His good memory and worst memory is the same thing. Oh, yeah, my first memory is the worst memory. Dan, you don't remember nothing? Oh, I remember my. What were you doing? Worst memory or first memory? First. First memory, I remember the window of my parents' bedroom when I was real little, like like three. Like, I remember them, when we lived in Connecticut, I just remember they had a, a window at the top, like one of those, like, it was the roof, you know? And then, like, I just remember looking at the window, being held, looking out the window. And then the worst memory is I remember my mom on the phone, hanging up, and then looking at me and going, Dad doesn't live here anymore. Ugh. And you go, what? Oh, that's brutal. You go, what does that mean? And she was like, he just doesn't sleep here anymore. And you're Get off like, your phone, you fucking idiot. No, he's first, telling a story, his worst story, but his dad not living there, and you're uh, fucking scrolling. No, no, no. I have, no, I'm not scrolling, dickhead. I have to fucking put more money in my meter so I can continue to podcast. So, Damn, it wouldn't sorry. be a big deal Damn. to everyone at home because nobody you, would notice. You it. just did that. You do. You were on something else before that. No, I wasn't. Damn. You are you? Are you lying? No. Are you? Li- were, you were you on before that? 
Nothing. You were scrolling before that through no, fucking stuff. I wasn't. You're saying that to make yourself right for some crazy reason. You were, You just went right to the app. That's it. Yes. You're lying. I'm not lying. What was your Look first? at me in the eyes and what tell the me fuck you're not you're lying. You're a liar. I'm not lying. You're, what, you're fucking lying. I'm not lying. What you're lying. Your, what was your first worst memory? I don't know. Worst. I don't know. I'd have to think about these things. That Ken Griffey Jr. Thing. shirt rules. It's fun. Baseballism. Great, great store. Great stuff. Um, yeah. You don't have a bad memory, you remember? I first lots one? lots of bad memories. What's the know. first one that you're like, fuck? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I have really? a hard time remembering something. Damn, Joe. Lewis. Yeah. I was a lot of, a lot of pain. I mean, dude, so. Lewis is going to fucking clean us out. I, said, I remember one time my mom <laughs> and my, my dad like fighting. We were living in a hotel, and I just remember there was like just broken glass everywhere. Today, People peasant in the streets and that they just they were, don't care. Oh, 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 oh. That, that, was, that they were playing the floor is glass. <laughs> <laughs> we had different variants of the, the same game. The floor is blood. <laughs> the, the floor, floor is needles. The floor is spilled drugs. Yeah. The, the floor is food stand. Yeah. <laughs> the, floor is, <laughs> the floor is other hookers. Damn, dude. Wow, that's Whenever you give one. memories, I'm always like, good job. Yeah. You did a real good job in life. Yeah, no, it's fine. My worst memory is when I... When she married the second guy, yeah, I mean the first guy, the piece of shit, piece of shit. I was in my room on my beanbags, fell asleep, and I woke up to like screams. Mm -hmm. And I, you know, I was happy as ever. Yeah. And I went in the other room, and my sister was crying. Uh oh. My mother was hunched over. Oh boy. And my sister was trying to use the phone, and he took the phone and threw it at my sister's head. Okay. And then he punched my mother in the stomach. Yuff. Wow. And then I, my mother saw me and grabbed me and my sister and dragged us into her room. Yikes. And sh shut the door and I shut it and held it. This is a scene from the movie Not Without My Daughter. I remember, the, remember <laughs> this distinctly, dude. And You're making this up right now. Yeah. Dude, don't tell me I'm fucking It was me. Sally Field. Shut the fuck up. Not Without My Daughter. Shut the fuck up. And then I'm getting emotional. He, what a he, fag. I know, I am a what fag. A I really That's so mad. funny. <laughs> I think he's triggered, he just what if, triggered me. What if this is the, <laughs> this is the climax to Wonderland? <laughs> yeah. He just triggered me. You know why? Because so he, he looks like the dude that That's my mom so married. Funny. He, goes, he, Bob, look, he looks Lewis like Billy. Like, you couldn't even stop that door. Bobby's like, like, no. could open that door and Bobby goes, he I did. He, have, though. he actually kicked the door and I went flying against the wall. And I slid down. That's your first memory of flying. I pretend, I pretend, I pretended that I was dead. And he went, he goes, you're not hurt, you fucking pussy. Jesus. Yeah. And then he Bobby, got on Bobby went. <laughs> Bobby went. <laughs> I booger oh. came out. Bobby went. Yeah. Lewis. Ah, don't wipe it. Bobby. Ah, get out of here. Uh, he went. He went. <laughs> I'm going to throw up. Went, Bobby's like, then I, got a, pussy. <laughs> then I got on a roller coaster and got away from the zombie chimps. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah, that was, that was the worst. Jesus. That's a fucking horrible first memory. Yeah, it was a bad Mine was just a phone call. My mom's like, nah, whatever. You don't have a male influence. I remember really? my mom telling me my dad died. Really? Yeah. How old are you? Six? Uh, four. Yuff. That might be my my one of my earliest memories too. It's like, we well, how did she tell you? Um, through jumped uh, out of a cake. <laughs> she goes, <laughs> he's gone. She was at a bachelor party. <laughs> She set up a scavenger hunt for me and my sister. And each, we had one clue that led us to another clue. And the last one was, what is it? And there was just a death certificate. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, she sat me down on my Grandma Rose's bed. And I just remember being a blue comforter on the bed. And she was crying. And she was like, your dad's dead. And just that matter of factly, like, your dad's dead. Yeah. She's like, your dad's dead. And I just remember not crying, like trying to hold it in, like just being like, no, it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Is that when that photo was taken? No. <laughs> No, Bobby. Obviously, it was like one in that photo. It was yeah. a joke. Whoa, age Fucking baby. idiot. Relax. Fuck face. <sighs> Joe, do you remember your worst memory? Yeah, it keeps coming back to me. I mean, I don't. If we're going like tragedy things like this, I mean, I don't know. I don't have quite the. Go, but I remember my dad backhanding me in the face in a car. Really what? hard. That's your well, fucking that's, memory. That's what I remember. The one time your dad hit you. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's keep like, it at What were you war. doing? I was like, I don't know. I wasn't doing anything. I was just being myself. That's what was so shocking about it. Oh, so you were just, just being, being silly. Funny. You were yeah, just, just being a silly, silly boy. And then I had a handprint on my face. It was an improvement like, from that other oh. photo, technically. Could we be serious for one moment? <laughs> Why do we have to all, t when we're discussing our faggy memories, we have to all get very real about it? <laughs> well, I didn't want to <laughs> no, get real. Listen, dude. It, uh, I you tried do to get that, three You get in that thing. And when you're in it, you got to get slapped you're the like, fuck out like of it. You're yeah. it. You're like, yeah. hey, guys, I'm in a bad yeah. place. <laughs> yeah, when he did that to me, I was like, fuck you, it was yeah. real. <laughs> yeah, yeah, good, way to, good way to end a pod. Real serious yeah. childhood trauma. That's no, funny stuff, dude. This, it's actually the, the point of oh, comedy is turning tragedy into comedy, dude. Yeah, oh, I thought it was to be funny. Oh, God. Fucking idiot.
Wow. We, Joe, wow. we put Joe into a dark place right now. He's imagining, he's remembering that backhand from his papa. <laughs> his papa? His papa, papa, papa? Papa? We're white. Let's say <laughs> papa. Um, father. Yes, father. So what were you, what was the moment that he smacked you? What was the thing you were doing? That's what I'm saying. I don't know. I was just kind of being silly. And he was like, wah just and then I remember, uh, yeah, I have a few memories like that, but some of them are older. I remember uh, watching, I guess I was 11, so it's not an early memory, but I remember watching the 93 World Series, and then uh, my uncle Dale, who you know, my yeah. cousin, my buddy, they all got jumped. They were walking home, <clears throat> and uh, these like three gentlemen. Nurses? Jumped out of the <laughs> These nurses that Bobby does not want to use. <laughs> three zombie chimps. They jumped out and attacked them, and I came, they came running in to like get bats. I'm like, we just got attacked. We got to go. And it was like this crazy thing, and I remember thinking, like, what? Like, down the street from my house, people were attacked and jumped, and then it was like a big thing, and the police got called, and then I remember... My family saying, um, "Like, go take Joe to whatever to whatever town with his aunt, because if he has less of an audience, he'll be less uh, he'll be less obnoxious." And I remember thinking, "Like, I'm going through this trauma, trying to have fun and and, and be. I'm scared to death." And they were like, "Get him out of here because he's annoying." Oh, so you were trying to be funny in the moment because everyone yeah, was just killing was, each other with baseball bats in a race war. <laughs> I was scared, <laughs> and so I was just acting up or whatever. They were like, "Get him out of here because he's got too much of an audience here." And I remember also being just that, doesn't that suck though that. when they're like, ah, "He's got an audience." And you're like, "I'm I'm doing good." Or they would like, do something relieving. when you're when you're, when you're, when you're I'm trying. My mom would like like. She'd hit me or yell at me, and I'd start crying. And then everyone would talk about how tired I am. He's just tired. It was like, no, you're you abusing me. me. Yeah. yeah. I'm yeah, my not mom, tired. My mom would always be like, uh, yeah, you're weird. You like talk to yourself. You're like, bitch, I'm alone. <laughs> well, I then, got nobody. Uh, I'm trying then, to just fucking, yeah. And then nobody addresses the thing. Nobody sits you down and goes, well, you know, whatever. So then you just have to live your life being like, at any moment, someone can attack me. And then you go to Austin 25 years later, and it happens again. And then you go and talk to the guy that has the least amount of sympathy for you, Joe Rogan, where you go, I almost got attacked. He goes, yeah. he's like, defend yourself, woman. He goes, yeah, that's crazy. <laughs> woman. <laughs> no, he said the opposite. He's like, you did the right thing. You got to get out of there. Yeah. But his reasoning was uh, that I would have, I could have killed him and gone to you jail. Oh, that's right. Joe does have that weird thing where he's like, he's like, yeah, do you punch a guy, you kill him with one punch, and then they're where you're at. <laughs> exactly. That's exactly. not exactly. happening to anybody. He goes, I was like, yeah, oh, yeah. he goes, Joe, you're a walking <laughs> weapon. And the rest is like, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, you're like a real dangerous dude. And Joe goes, ah, fucking, I'm a long distance runner. <laughs> By the way, I do this exact bit in Enough for Everybody on hey, YouTube right hey, now. YouTube. Demonetized, because I said cunt, so watch it at punchuplive.com. Um, they demonetize you for saying cunt. That's yeah, crazy. Yeah, it's did. so random, though. It's not even that, because I said so much worse than mine, and mine wasn't demonetized. Yeah. The guy, no, they, I, I talked to the guy at YouTube, and I was like, what gets you demonetized? I just asked him, and he was like, just don't cuss for the first two minutes. No, they specifically told me, he said, the C word for them is- Oh, it's C like, and the N word. C yeah, word the N -word, N yeah, exactly. He said, it's a nuclear bomb. Yeah. It's just up there with the N word. Those are the two words. Yeah. If you say- Because he said, uh, he did say that to me. He goes, if yeah. don't say the C word, or the he said, don't say- I guess I didn't say cunt in mind. Yeah. No. Which you go, oh, I did have a chance. Yeah, but you're not that dirty. <laughs> yeah. But what's so frustrating? I mean, right? You, no, you're, you're not, not that, that dirty. dirty. Are you kidding? I don't think you're that dirty. What you what do you do? Are you kidding? Are you being funny? <laughs> are you being funny right now? Or <laughs> what are you I doing? Here to amuse you? <laughs> you're not that dirty. What's your dirtiest job? I'm literally one of the dirtiest comedians in the world. Are you out of your Stamp fucking mind? it, cut That's it, just put it out. The color. stuff I watched the stuff I watched it. the other day at your house is not dirty at all. It's a joke about me sucking your cock on stage, Bobby. Wait, that is entire, the whole, it's a whole act. You, I'll tell invited, you, what. you invited Bobby over to watch your stand up? Uh, no, I showed him a bit. That nah, I, I asked him to see some stuff. I don't think that's that dirty. That can't be true. It's pretty dirty. Uh, I have to pay. Yeah, but the way the you present it isn't that dirty. Of course. I, it's not dirty to you because you're a comedian, but like, it, like literally. And it was my dick thing, you yeah. sucked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So my, I know how dirty my shit is because James is such a big stand-up comedy fan and I can only show him certain things. So I know the standard of like yeah. where, and there's like five or six bits that I can even show him. And even those bits, his mom is mad that I showed him. Does he like have a comedy guy that he likes? He yeah, loves Gaffigan. Ma Ma uh, Max loves love, Fluffy. Loves Gaffigan, loves, um, what's his name? Regan. Regan. Yeah. Love Good Gaffigan taste. And Regan. Max yeah. likes Stuart Eddie, Mur Eddie Murphy. Uh, he hasn't watched the whole thing, but the Goona Goo Goo. The Aunt Be oh, I thought he was, like, he was like, I got to turn quick so these faggots can't see my ass. <laughs> yeah. No siren, just a real fag. <laughs> woo, woo, woo. woo. Pull no. over. Pull over. No, that, that bit in particular, the Goona Goo Goo falling down the stairs. Yeah. Like he, Goona I mean, Goo Goo. 
Dude, it was the first stand-up that I ever really showed him. That's great. And he fucking just, he loves it. Yeah. Loves Eddie it. Murphy, I mean, dude. Eddie Murphy, I mean, when I, was, when I was a kid, when I saw Eddie Murphy, yeah. both those specials, that was like- I saw Raw first, and then when someone put on Delirious for me, I was like, this is this guy's even the better The funniest though. thing in the fucking I think world. Raw was better, right? No. Uh, no, Delirious. No. Delirious, think Delirious, is Delirious, is Delirious, better? Delirious is better. Delirious is better. Raw, Raw has the, a bunch Raw, of garbage the, on it. The, but the Johnny Carson. Raw's the second one, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Raw's the one where he like comes out and he's like talking about Delirious. Yeah, he yeah. talks about Delirious, but he it's also- good, but it's not- he, the, like, the, the Johnny Carson. The Bill Cosby stuff is funny and-, and Put and that with the rest. Yeah. No, <laughs> Raw's amazing. 77 Raw's million. Raw's great. But there, it's and, amazing. But there's fat on it. The whole Twister thing, yeah. left hand- It's a lot- There's but, a long chunks of- You know what it is? What's the Rocky one? Is that Raw or That's That's Delirious. Wait, the, Rock, the Rocky? Bits? No, that's Raw. That, I mean, that's the best no, that's bit raw. from. No, it is. Yeah, that's it is. Raw. It's Raw. 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 Uh, Juju uh, Fruit <laughs> saying uh, he's going to pay for it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm that's sorry, amazing. little white man. You must have just seen Rocky. <laughs> that was a funny goes, bit. I do love Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> <laughs> so good, dude. He goes, <laughs> they call the cops. I mean, we're talking about like two of the funniest. He, was, both of them are great. Raw and Delirious are both great. Two of the funniest hour and a half specials. And then he just said, I'm just not going to do this anymore. I'm just going to become oh a movie star. God. And he had the ability to be. The best comic in the fucking world. Like, yeah. it's bonkers how talented Eddie Murphy was. I mean, that whole bit Funny about Eddie, he was like 21. Yeah, 21 and 24. And his song wasn't that bad. No, he's 22 and 27. Party oh, all the time? Part IQ. You know what, though? <laughs> Keegan Ivory Wayne's wrote. wrote. Yeah, party all the time is not bad. I love it. Rick James produced it. It's a great no, fucking Those song. specials are the I hate myself and enough of everybody. Enough for, I couldn't get my... Uh, <laughs> I have yeah, to miss it. so bad. Right, Come we, on, we're it's we're love you guys. We're We'll see you next time. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Uh, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, Lewis, congratulations on your win. Thank congratulations you, on the yeah, W. Lewis. Go Fuck check out, the, go check out my podcast, guy. Out Now. Oh, no, this is coming out on Tuesday. Oh, I have to piss. Coming That's out next week. Thank you. Check out, of course... Everything that we do, but mainly this. We'll see you guys next time. It's the Regs. <laughs>